Okay, wow, sorry, I'm, I'm a little late. I didn't realize it had been 15 minutes already. Anyway, um, I promise it will be worth the anticipation. Hello, everybody. Good to see all of you. How's it going? Um, happy Wednesday. Hope everyone's having a good week as of this, uh, midpoint day here. Uh, how you doing, Zass? Um, how's, how's the BL2? How's, how's the girls? How's, um... How's everything? Hey, Randy, good to see you. 15 minutes late? Wait, what time is it? No, I'm like seven minutes late in total. Uh, appearing in webcam form, you know, like actually after the starting soon screen. It's only been an extra seven minutes. <laughs> I'm glad to see that you're just that excited. What's up, Randy? Hello, Archfiend. Hey, Joshy. Um, hey, Jolts. Hey, Biznap. Uh, let's see... Bob, good to have you bright and early. Also, same to you, Kale. Shouldn't shouldn't both of you guys be working? Aren't aren't both of you guys like actually in the office right now? It's okay. Um, I won't tell either of your bosses. Hey, Quaylon, how you doing? How's your boss? You know, the cat. Um, hey, replicant, bright and early as always. And hey, Glurdo. And hey, bunny emote. You quit your job. Wait, that actually happened. Happened. I, I knew about your, um, you know, planned life changes. You pulled the trigger on that. Like, you're gone. Oh my god. Fucking congrats. <laughs> I know that you were, like, you know, successful there. It's just that it wasn't, um, you know, gratifying. It wasn't fulfilling. <laughs> and that was a, you know, big deal. But man, <laughs> cool congrats again. <laughs> So, now what? What's what's next? Can't wait for what's next. Yeah, yeah, what's next? I know that you were planning on moving again, right? Um, what about, like, you know, career? Again, you know, you being, like, a successful individual and all in your field. Uh, what's... What, what's your plan? <sighs> um, let's see. Uh, Googly, good to see you. How's it going? As I, as I try to figure out what... MCC is... Oh, we haven't continued since last update, uh, last update stream yesterday. Spent some time with a friend, helping him finish his last achievement to 100% complete the full Halo Master Chief Collection. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, that's a lot of video games. Um, and I, um, don't really know anything about them. Um, or, like, you know, the, uh, percentage counters therein. But wow. Is it fun? Is, is like, all of the percentage counting content fun or is it like borderlands one man i was watching um uh k6 in the morning um doing his like bl1 100 percent completion and it just you know reinforced my decision about like you know not doing the everything playthrough in bl1 like we did in bl2 and tps except for the grinder yeah <laughs> There's 700 achievements. Oh man, the dopamine. <laughs> By the time you finish with that, you know, that must be like so much a part of your life. You know, like like you had been uh, doing that for, you know, so many months that afterwards it's like surreal and what do you do with yourself? <laughs> yeah, why? BL1 is so fun. Yeah, no, BL1's great. I don't have anything against BL1. I can't replay it as much. Um, although actually, uh, you know, the... Um, Discussion about assigned drop overhaul does have me looking forward to doing more BL1 playthroughs, plural, since that is more my type of progression format that I crave. Um, no, it's it's the 100% aspect, or the everything aspect, whatever word you want to come up with for it, for BL1 that just seems completely unappealing. You know, like, even... The least of the bad things, uh, like, you know, the 20 rounders to me just, you know, seems, um, not like something that I would want to get to the point of doing. Let alone, uh, some of the challenges in that game, you know, the, like, 2,000 duels or whatever. Hmm. Googly. Uh, internally screaming to get everything ready. Yeah, 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 and externally calm while you actually do it, right? Passed out from exhaustion last night due to the stress. Oh, that's good. Your body was like, hey, you would benefit from some sleep right now. And so it did. <laughs> good. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Again, this is where I try to find the upside of, like, you know, all of this um, effort and gratification will pay off in the form of wonderful reward. 
<laughs> you know, as long as you don't die first <laughs> on the way there. <laughs> don't die, Googly. Don't, it'll be worth it if you survive. Yeah. Anyway, you guys want to play video games? Speaking of surviving, um, uh, you, you. <clears throat> Where were we? Maker sequence, we don't need to um, do anything more gear-wise. Um, we have our gub, so we're set. Let's have that. Uh, man, we got, like, a lot of stuff, huh? Go figure. Um, also, like, you know, Axton. And immediately when I load in and Axton's, you know, like, doing all of this so fast, I'm just excited. But I kind of want to warm up. <laughs> or something. What um what are we actually going to be using? So, next goal is get to uh Iridium Blight to farm Mal for uh uh more butchers and then we'll beat the game with butchers. But, you know, we we just got to get through opportunity safely and bunker safely. And the gub is like a legit option for that. It would probably go better if I Metal stormed, but you know, I don't Yeah, actually shit. Maybe I should maybe I should actually run the gub. Which Malquest has butchers the last one, which is why I'm actually talking about it. It's the fastest one. Load in, attack Mal, get butcher, save quit, go again. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's one of the few checks in the game where I would actually consider like it to be a viable butcher farm. And I love that. You know, I love that aspect of the randomness. Sometimes you get a very picky weapon, a very part-specific weapon, from a source that isn't fast enough to farm its pickiness, and sometimes you do. And in this seed, the stars align for the butcher. Um, so yeah. But yeah, again, we gotta get there first. Um... What do we have available to us? Where was the Layuda from? Let me... Let me open my... Uh... Uh, we are BG... Uh, is that .txt? That one's old. Okay, so this one. Layuda. Enchanted Skeleton. Oh yeah, that's right. But um, yeah, we're not, we're not doing that. Um... Tell you what, let's warm up with some underleveled finishing of Hollowed Hollow. Um, we started this DLC just to have a farm for. Actually, you know what? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's get a new bandit shotgun for free. Then we'll go do Hollowed Hollow. Uh, we started Hollowed Hollow just to get the Tubby farm, because Tubbies are a source for Legendary Soldier, and I wanted a plus four and everything Legendary Soldier. But then we didn't go any further in it, and I kind of want to just see those, like, free checks. You have Poetic License to give to Daisy. What was that? Purple Sniper? Question mark? Poetic License, Bandit Launcher. Okay. What level is that in this playthrough? Is it... In TVHM, is it 45? It's 45? Shit, let's get a new bandit launcher, bro. Also, did we check Rocco's? I should at least have Rocco's picked up, if not also turn in when we go there. But yeah, actually, genius. Let's farm a freaking level 45 purple bandit launcher as um, a safety net. Thank you. Hey, slab. Hey, brick. I'm gonna stay here in sanctuary for the long uh, time. That's slabs. all for Bert Still here. Do you not do anything? No, I haven't done anything about McShooty yet. Um, cause that's kind of like small beans, you know. Like it's easily avoidable. Don't worry, I am planning on fixing it. It's just I didn't prioritize that over the other, uh, actual like blockers. You know, like Mal. I had to fix Mal because there's, um. No way of, like, there was no way of, like, re-interacting with Mal. With Face McShooty, you just save quit if you fuck up, quote-unquote. Again, it's not actually on you. You know, it's not really you fucked up. Point is, though, you can fix it, so I didn't prioritize that yet. Mission editing takes a long time. <laughs> I'm sick of McShooty. 
No clerk. Who's to say no clerk? We're, we have clerk in our seed. We'll probably do clerk. Oh, wow. that purple sniper. Hey, that's pretty cool. Not that one, but like in general. Oh, also after Bunker, we get new antagonist. Yeah, right, right, Glurdo. Um, like it's avoidable, and if it happens, you can fix it. Um, so I didn't, I didn't rush that one, but I will fix it eventually. Uh, yeah, let's do better than that. Hey, Ravenor, good to see you. How are you? Um, thousand cuts is this map. I don't think I even remember that quest at all. Well, then you won't get all of the joke that I uh, added to that quest. Um, but hopefully it'll still tickle you. Okay, let me get rid of some things. That's not useful. That would only be if we were DPS orc and it's level 38, so it's not useful. We're gonna get better than that. I'll keep the crit fibbers. No, you know what? I'll sell the crit fibbers. We'll get crit fibbers again if we get a B. And that's a big if. Um, okay. Goodbye, friend. Sham was doctor's orders, right? Yeah, and we did that a couple times, and we still didn't get a sham that was better than 86. Pick up Scooter's camera. Hang myself from my own tombstone if within you I cannot... Yeah, yeah. Um, that's a good call, because that way you'll scare away any uh, women that aren't specifically obsessed with Borderlands 2. And God forbid you date a woman that isn't obsessed with Borderlands 2. Big links make me nauseated. Yeah, we were just talking about that. <laughs> he looks so stupid. And it's not his fault. <laughs> I love, I love mid-dog running individual frames. <laughs> Thank you. That was a good thumbs. I was at the start of a tornado. Clearly, right, right. Out of context individual frame, what we can determine is that it's mid-tornado. How did you phrase hints in the auto-tracking? Like, did you use a question mark? No, I didn't. Do you think I should? I, um... I, I, I pondered over that when I did it, and I figured just leave it exactly what the hint says. Yeah, 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 exactly. Leave it. How the hint says it. Like, I did the question marks for myself, but it, there, there isn't actually any... Yeah. Please no, spreadsheet auto marks. Okay, good, good. Yeah, that, that is another reason to keep it uh, pure from stylization. You would like to add the question marks to mine? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Eventually, the options menu is just going to, um, you know, be 20 pages long um, and include, like, you know, every possible uh, formatting that you could have for everything. Um, you know, I'll let you choose between comma delimited for CSV or tab delimited for tab delimited. I'll let you um, add question marks to the end. I'll let you, uh, yeah. Hey, Logo! Thanks, Logo. My dream job would be to clean mirrors. I could really see myself doing that. Mm -hmm. Hey, you know, if you unsubbed, then I wouldn't be subject to that in future sub messages. <laughs> How you doing, Logo? Happy eight months. Thanks, regardless. <laughs> How you doing, dude? How's your week so far? Hello, Gage! Holy moly! Oh my god, you know, uh, shit. I actually meant to do the thing. With blah. 
And I didn't remember until I just saw you. Hey, Roland, handsome Jack here. Remember me? My men kicked your bandit asses out of New Haven and killed your little pal Lilith. Ring any bells? Anyway, I hear you and the rest of your little buddies have relocated to Sanctuary. Just wanted to congratulate you. <laughs> <laughs> See me? Makes you think I'm dumb, even. It's not dumb! How dare you say that? That cat is the way God made him. My cat is learning to retract his claws. claws. Really? He, uh, he didn't. He wasn't born with that skill. A query that I'm happy with for Excel, but I didn't add any additional formatting for hints. Yeah, right. right. Yeah, I mean, the only reason to have additional formatting for hints would be uh, if you wanted to like go through the spreadsheet, filling things in that you hadn't yet. That's another thing that I want to fix that's not a priority, is Daisy talking after she dies. I think that kind of kills the joke a little bit. Alright, totally workable. That's good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Molly One Barrel. So someone who tries to climb onto your shoulder when you play games. Oh, but I think, I think that's him actually very deliberately extending his claws, you know, for better traction while climbing. Your flesh. Never did a lot of spitter action, but this ogre, oh my god. Dude, ogre is like number one on the list of guns that... Uh, loot rando actually lets you experience and have fun with when you normally never would in vanilla. Shock. These Hyperion fascists thinks he's safe. Um. Okay, but also actually like fire so that you can walk outside. Nice. If you're gonna be a part of the Crimson Raiders. I can't love to massage me when I try to sleep. So I'm back inside. Dude, banana doesn't. Banana does not make biscuits. He's like he's broken. He also doesn't cuddle anymore. <laughs> Do I have fire? Please tell me. Oh my god, I had fire and then I sold it. All right, as long as we don't kill ourselves with world burn, which I'm kind of terrified of. Um. Um, do I have anything else? Fire. I have nuke. If I, you know, respec. Oh god. No, this is fine. Go, go to the firing range. Fire weapons are Cat doesn't make biscuits, he just stomps it. But crap at destroying go to hell, bandits! Now, Thank you. Burn that in Okay, shock. Let's take that off. Feel this bastard like a skag steak. These hype. Take that, Jack Lover. Take that, Jack Lover. Take that, Jack Lover. Oh. Yeah, a few good hits from me. All right. These um, something that's not take fire, that, and then we're good. Lover. Yeah. These hype. Bandit or torque take barrel. That, Jack Lover. Preferably. Yeah. Okay, better than a that. Few these hype. Take that, Jack, Jack Lover. These hype. Take that, Jack Lover. 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 Lover. Take that, hey, Jack Lover. Cat just hype. stares at me and licks any Take available that, plastic. Lover. Yeah, my cat just stares at These me and then, like, um, you know, pounces. Jack Lover. Uh, when I come, like, within the danger zone. Take that, Jack Lover. Oh, wait, what was that? Oh, man. You know what? Fine. Good enough. All right, let's go. Flight's long. Hey, Roxas, how's it going? Okay, we good? Yeah. Mom found a desk to replace uh, my old one next to my chair. Okay. 
When bought it from flea market for 15 euro, only had to shorten the legs for it to be the same height as your armrest. Oh, cool. Sick. Hey, Ultras. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's funny hearing the not no, no, no Marcus dialogues. Thanks to Lou Rando, right? We get to hear Jack Lover. Um, yeah. Uh, hollowed hollow. Bum Boat Woman. Annie Daly, Navy Bumboat Woman, Proceedings. Hers was a pleasant personality, and she had the appearance of a successful businesswoman, rather than that of a bumboat woman. Although she was a great success. <laughs> uh, okay, I guess Gilbert and Sullivan coined the term bumboat, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> no. <laughs> Popularized it. Okay, so where were we in this? Uh, enchanted skeletons, that's right. But this is like level 39, and we're well equipped. And again, I just want to, you know, do some chill gameplay warm up. Um, where did. Hi. Bumbo woman make do. I yeah, huh? Do I have an on level ish shield right now even? What am I running with? Alright, 43, good enough. That'll get us through. Bunker sequence. Why did I do two? That was so foolish. Are Bumbo women like fat bottom girls? I don't know. I think it's supposed to, you know, like describe a certain working class uh, or something, but I don't, yeah. More like you this, dude. Yeah. Um, okay, but like, didn't I open all the crypts back here and I didn't get one? No. Okay, there's more. Hey, brain freeze. How's it going? Uh, if I played this mod co-op with a friend, would only one character get comms? No, I actually, uh, not to toot my own horn, but I designed that much better than that. Um, the comms are all lumped together, one per comm drop per character. And then, you know, whichever character you're playing is the one that you will get from quest rewards. Same as in vanilla missions that give comm quest rewards. Um, but then from enemy drops, the comms are weighted directly proportionally to the number of each class being played at the time in the lobby. So if you just have one Maya and one Axton and you kill a boss that has a comm drop, you will get 50% chance Maya comm, 50% chance Axton comm. If you have two Mayas and an Axton, then, um, you know, 67% uh, uh, chance Maya, 33% chance Axton, etc. Oh, 
Mine doesn't do that. He will jump into your arms and lick your face. Oh, really? If I pick up banana, um, then for like, you know, the five seconds of patience that he has, he will lick my face. Sometimes like my actual eyeball. Hey, nice. Great dude, have fun. But then he squirms and, you know, he wants to go do other things. He's just, he's, the, the thing about bananas, he's just too active. Like, he, um, doesn't want to sit still long enough to cuddle or, uh, be held. He wants to be doing things. He's so social. Like, he loves people. He loves us. He always wants to be around us. He's just not, like, you know, physically affectionate. All right, Sully is fireball. Cool. Nevertheless, better get that hammer from him. I know. I only know of the boatmen, little water bugs. I think I know the water bugs you're talking about. In in your part of the world, you have a nickname for them, that is boatmen. Huh. Considering spending 32 bucks to get both the girls the Headhunter DLCs before we really get that far into Rando Run. Oh, well, Zass, so, um... Oh, well, did you create a seed that had the Headhunter DLCs in it? I made it so that you could avoid that problem, right? So if you do new seed, you can turn off any DLC uh, that, you know, you and your party or the, your friends that you're sharing your seed with or whatever. Um... Uh, don't get screwed by lack of DLCs. You know, like, if you turn off Waddle Gobbler, then there won't be any Waddle Gobbler checks. Hey, Jude, how's it going, dude? Willing to make a seed to include those? Yeah, yeah, save you 32 bucks. If, um, you know, you wouldn't actually get $32 worth of fun out of them. Wait, so that was an enchanted skeleton outside of the mission, which I didn't think could happen. I mean, I guess technically we are doing the mission, but can you farm enchanted skeletons all around? Like, not as part of the scripted beginning? Do I need to nerf enchanted skeletons? Octo is your first item in Lurano from Knuckle Dragger. <laughs> Had to be that unique shotgun, huh? Not that the Octo is bad, especially early game. But, like. What a no name gun, bro. I want to do it later. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, yeah, you can't edit a seed later. Never use the Octo, this is cool. Okay, yeah, yeah, 100%. Okay, I do spawn randomly, but it's pretty rare. Would it be considered very rare, perchance? Hey Pyrex, how's it going? Huh. This is definitely where the pumpkin king Okay, let me remember the one the life route for this headhunter. I bet if you flood the area, that avoids the uh the scrack. Because even overleveled uh, scrack terrify me. Um Okay, we want to get uppies. Uh... Wait, we do need the head to windmill objective. Also, we can get rid of you. Hmm. 
Yeah, boo. That. Oh. Uh. Okay, try again. Try again. That way? Nope, not even close. Bounce a little bit this way? There we go. God, I hate Scratch so much. Are those space hmm. pants? Here. Because your butt is Thumbs. space. Hey, your thanks, butt is dude. From space. Appreciate that. Thanks for getting our Quaylon, man. Windmill ain't working, is it? Real good friend, Quaylon. Appreciate that. Must be the scrap nesting up there in the blades. Quaylon, enjoy the sub from our good friend Thumbs, dude. I bet this is frustrating for you. Okay, Scrag are good. Oh, delicious. Okay, uppies again. Now that we've hit that trigger. Oh my god, accent! Thank you. Okay, so I can hit this. Those abominations there were made by that. good old Dr. Zed. Speaking of which, have you seen Zed? Because the other one right Ted there? Lately? What about Ted? Oh, oh, wait. I'm so sorry. We ain't supposed to talk about the forbidden brother. My bad. Uh, boop. Good. Uh, boop. Boop. Good. Legends of the creature who kicked him out of the Iridium Blight. Good. Was a real big, small or normal size All right. Woman. Not even hard. The windmill's going, so the blood's pumping, and everything's ready for a final showdown with the Pumpkin Kingpin. Whenever you're ready, just head Why'd back to the Kingpin's domicile. Why did he die? He had such a, like, <laughs> nice brain candy supply. Our I remember ever seeing extra enchanted skeletons. And they do this head under sometimes while leveling. Okay. You know, but if they're possible, then maybe I should have them be very rare enemy instead of mission enemy. Who are you? Oh. Actually, I take it back. That's super annoying. Sorry, for context, that guy's running a pirated version of BL2. Like, he stole this game. And he's been spamming every channel in the Borderlands 2 directory. Trying to get people to help him run mods on it. That's his second time here. Okay. Hellfire! <laughs> wow, in this DLC. Giants and Southern Shelf drop greens. Oh, yeah. yeah. Turning the mod off now? I mean, you can still run Giants uh, with Loot Rando. They're just, there's no integration between the two, that's all. But yeah, um... When I made Reign of Giants, unlike in Loot Rando, Reign of Giants was not intended to break item progression. Loot Rando is. You know, two different things. Um, Reign of Giants, uh, if you are at too low of a level to get a world drop legendary, like in Liarsburg, you know, in vanilla, you can't get anything world drop higher than a green. Uh, Reign of Giants... Uh, giants drop you a loot explosion of greens instead. Uh, same thing with like the Gen 2 comms, right? Giants won't drop Gen 2 comms earlier than level 62. Um, just like in vanilla. They, they respect the item progression. 
Loot Rando, on the other hand, uh, the whole point is to undermine the item progression, so, yeah. Just want to see. Oh, yeah, totally, totally. Say something about the Enchanted Dudes. I was spacing out. I have, have heard it. Yeah, so I'm thinking that maybe I'll uh, recategorize Enchanted Skeletons to be very rare enemies instead of mission enemies. Since they're not exclusive to the mission, they can spawn randomly, but it's very rare. In fact, you know what? Let me just do that now. Catalog. Um, enchanted skeleton. Not mission. Tags equals tag dot very rare enemy. And that'll um, that'll actually keep their loot about the same as it is now. Uh, just um, if you have mission enemies off, but. Uh, Uh, very rare enemies on, then, you know, they'll spawn in your seat appropriately. Or be assigned in your seat appropriately. Look who's pro dud now. Yeah, dude, I, I'm surprised too. So, um, right now we are running, uh, these one life attempts with every single category of enemy check on. You know, we have raid bosses on. Uh, we have very long missions on, you know, mob enemies on, etc. Um, but we then, you know, also have duplicate items on, since I was concerned that, like, having 480-whatever locations um, to cover, you know, 317 items would be not fun. You know, like, like just so many dud sources. But Biznap and I, uh, yesterday, started a run where we have every single location enabled, but duplicates off, such that about one in three of our checks are duds, no item. Oh, interesting. Well, we don't need that. And it turns out I love it. And so we're going to be doing attempts like that from now on. We're going to turn dupes off. Leave every check off, every category on, turn dupes off. Um, turns out that dupes are actually, like, really fun. Uh, you know, like, it's uh, kind of like, you know, greater purity of randomness in a way. You know, like, uh, you get a dud and it's, like, full disappointment, but that's not a bad thing. It just increases the breadth of, like, outcomes that can happen when you do a check. Either it can be an item, or it could be a really good item, or it could be no item at all. More random is actually, like, more fun in that case, even though it is more fun as a result of moments of disappointment, you know? But then also, um, it's got all these other cool side effects, so, like, I have noticed doing this attempt, or the last attempt that it does actually make it a little easy when every single check gives you a new option for loot. You get more items, and you get more items to choose from. And having more items to choose from means, obviously, like, net out, you are more powerful. It's, it's, it's like, you know, almost too easy. Well, yeah, it's definitely too easy. So it adds a little bit of difficulty, and it increases the aspect that I like about Loot Rando of, based on randomness, you have to make do with what you get. You know, you don't get the best items in every playthrough. No, no, you get, like, items that you can make work, and, you know, having encouragement to make them work, even though it's less easy, is fun. And then the final thing... <laughs> um... is, uh, it's actually fun to, like, have the, uh, definitiveness of there not being duplicates throughout your seed. Like, if, um, you get a gearbox sniper, for example, like, you get an enemy, and the enemy's hint says, unique sniper, and your mind starts going through all the possibilities of what could unique sniper be, and, you know, you're like, oh, I hope it's gonna be a pimpernel, but then it turns out to be a unique sniper. If you have dupes on... Okay, you've eliminated one of your unique sniper checks. But um, since you have dupes, you could still get another uh, gearbox sniper 
from the next enemy that drops a unique sniper. If you don't have dupes on, then the moment you get the gearbox sniper, you know it's gone from, like, your list of possibilities. The next time you run into an enemy that drops unique sniper, you know it's not going to be a gearbox sniper. And that's fun. Like, that's a fun little mini game of itself. Like, um, uh, card counting, you know, keeping track of, like, what is and is not in your seed or what you do and do not have left to find, you know? So, yeah, anyway... Long story short, from now on, we're going to be running no dupes. Uh, only um, two-thirds of our checks will actually even have an item, period. All right. Um, long bout of discussion there, but... Uh, let's do Clark. Oh, we should also do the TK side mission. I completely forgot about that. I need to, I probably need to, like, look up all of the pumpkins. Let's see, I remember this one. Let's do one thing at a time, otherwise I'm going to try to relearn slash keep track of too many things at once. Now you got it. Oh yeah, that's right, Pyrex has them memorized, thank god. <laughs> Pyrex, my lifeline, my phone a friend. Okay, there's this one. Hey Arch, how you doing? I get to enjoy the various flavors of text we made for all the dupes. That's that too. Yeah. Like the bottles are cool. You know, like um, they're not all negative. Besides, you know, the fun of the randomness. The bottles themselves are kind of neat. All I heard was Raptor was right. Biznap was right too. Biznap was the one that um really forced me. Except Terra. Well, if you're level 45, you're almost ready for Terra. I believe in you. <laughs> you know what you could do is you could go to Bar Brawl. Uh... Um, and get level 50, and hopefully Bar Brawl Tier 3 gives you an item that you can kill Terra with, since that's your only way of getting level space pants, 50 your gear. Is space. Your butt is from space. <laughs> hey, Thumbs, thanks for getting Ken. Appreciate that. Good looking. Hey, Ken, how you doing? Enjoy the sub from our Thumbs. Thanks, Thumbs. Wait, is there... There's got to be another way around this way. Hey, Glasgow. Guess time for TVHM and then get a new seed, because why not? <laughs> well, you don't want to it, it, take all of the ac information that you acquired in normal mode and use it to build your character for, like, endgame and stuff. Homeowner's insurance. Oh, man. Dude, the details you have to consider now. Okay, I know that one of the pumpkins is, like, lava-related, but, like, where? Apparently it's not this way. I guess this is a dead end in the map. Okay, that was all invisible wall, thanks. Hey. Did you get the one on the windmill? Which windmill? No, I don't think so. Did I? No. <laughs> I got the TV back here. There's a pumpkin on the windmill? I don't remember that one. Okay, well, uh, in lieu of further information, I'm gonna... There isn't one as far as I... Yeah, there's nothing else on this side of the map you got... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, uh, I'm just trying to find out the shortest route back to the rest of the map, but apparently there isn't one of that either. How goes the run? Pretty good. 
Yeah, we got that one. Uh, we have one last TV that is... Oh god, please tell me that I have... Gear to throw in. Okay, we have... Everything but a shield. Oh shit, give me a shield. Almost dead? I can fix that. Sure. <laughs> That grenade will throw in. And... Cool. <laughs> Casual shield with a molly one part to throw in. Hello. Okay, I got the one over here. I got the one over here. We need to go through spider ant area? Oh, wait. No. No, nothing here. Brand new roof. Oh, cool. And siding. So the endorsements that cover full replace one of those are unnecessary. Uh, okay. If there's any damage, I can just go to Menards. <laughs> uh, get new siding or shingles, put them on yourself. Yeah. Lucky you being the kind of person that can do that. October Knuckle Dragger. Omen from Bad Hair Day turned into Claptrap. Wow. Yeah, what progress. Okay, here. Or like there. This lava related area. I guess we need to go from the other side. So, big loop. And also, there's the last TV down there. Where basement? Uh, mm, uh, mm. Eh? This one not here. Oh, okay, okay. It's in the other town. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Both are other side of him, right? I didn't get a three hundred fifty dollar rebate just for buying the siding I needed anyway. You mean from Menards? Nice. Meaning, the siding was $350 cheaper than the sticker price. Menards. Oh, really? My Nards! <laughs> Been there, bro. And then you. And then the last one is lava. Somewhere. Is it down there? Oh my god. Actually terrifying. Oh crap, where's the last one? Churchyard. Candy is lava. Candy is lava? Candy? Oh, you mean for the TK side quests. <gasps> oh my god. That um, was not the collision that I w was seeing. I think we're okay, but I can't fuck this up. 
I'm not just gonna save quit out of this. We're gonna get out of it. Um. Uh. Hold on. Okay, you know what? Forget this. We'll get a new one. Can we get new dupes? Ha ha ha. I just need to, like, make it there, and I'll be safe. And a grenade jump will do it, it's just that we only get one chance at it. Nope. Nope. Good job, me. Shouldn't have been in that position, but at least I fixed it. <laughs> Just to, you know, I had to add to the tension, you know? Add a little bit of drama for the, for the content. Yeah, so sketchiest part of this headhunter we're learning is um, lava and uh, all of the maneuvering around lava that we need to do to actually do checks in it. Um, and we should not take any collision or lack thereof for granted. You know, I should be very overly abundantly cautious when anytime I'm around lava, even if it looks like I think I know what it's like. Oh. The Pyrex said, I do not like this proximity lava. Yeah, no, I mean, neither did I, but I th still thought I understood it. No. But this is exactly what I wanted out of these runs, was, you know, like, learning all of the content. Not just Bloody Harvest for the OP10 playthrough, but, like, you know, this freaking Easter egg. And all of the little nuances that are involved. One hint's on the last two pumpkins? Wait, there's two? Uh, are you sure? I thought we were just missing one, but yes, please. I think you have two left. Okay, so we got this one. We got the other one that uh, is... Oh, wait. There is one more in the churchyard. I don't remember where it is, but I know that there is one more in the churchyard. Anyway, we got the one down there. We got the one up here. Do the hidden path by the church. The hidden path by the church. One around where Clark spawns from, and another one from spawn. Oh, the one! Yep, the one at the very beginning of the map. That's right. One around where Clark spawns. I th did we not get... Th are you talking about the one down there? That one? I got that one. Clark spawns from here. There's two here. Define here. Uh, we got the one that's, like, just up these stairs to the left. Ne you know, to next to the church. So maybe I'm just missing the one at spawn. Oh, there's two down here, down these stairs. Oh, okay. Well, then we are missing one. Ah! Thank you. All right, cool. All right, and then the one at spawn. Yeah, you were right. I was missing two. Didn't know about that one. Mm -hmm. 
Church tells you what you have. Oh, that's cool. Neat. Okay. Hopefully, this will be the last time I need to do it. Uh, uh, quote unquote blind. Hopefully, that will have reinforced it all for me, but. Alright, now we just need to do the sacrifice. Um. Where's the nearest grenade lying on the ground? Should go buy one from the vendor. So we need to go this way anyway. Fires of torches. Yeah, right, right. Hey, how you doing, Evan? Good to see you. How weak. When you think murder, think Marcus Munitions. Don't die. Huh? Okay, now what am I full on? Oh my god. Oh. Sorry, Gov. Shield, grenade, and pistol. Let me get. We're gonna sacrifice the Gub. Give me that Gub back. It's got an important prophecy. It's ha it must fulfill its destiny. Any gun doesn't have to be pistol. It has to be this gub. Any gun. <laughs> like any gun has the same destiny as this one. Yay, hey, Eggboy. How you doing? Great to see. You. Yeah, it has to be any gub. All right. The chosen gub. Imagine it becomes another cooler gub. Oh, dude, if Clark turns out to be, like, our second gub source. Okay. Grenade. Shield. Dude, another enchanted skeleton. I had no idea. I thought these guys were, you know, hell exclusive. Why are you fucking being able to think shooting you? Maybe they're not even very rare enemy. Maybe they're just rare enemy. Or maybe it's just like this because, you know, we haven't save quit since we did the mission. All right, Clarky. <laughs> Hello, Siren's Flame. How you doing? Good to see you. I think I saw you tech pistol. Hey, hey, Pretty sure. Yep, you tech one. pistol. That was absolutely not worth our time. But now we know we have that check checked off. Hello, K6. Great to see you. How are you? How how many times have you ever done this Easter egg? The the like Clark the Combustible Crypt Keeper Easter egg. Watch out in front of you. Wow. Of all the places I've been watching out, seems like the most obvious. Oops. All right. How about this mission? When's the last time you've done this mission? Trick or treat. Side note: We almost lost this one life. A lava. Things that you learn, you know, doing all of the content in a one life for the first time. <laughs> anyway, how's, uh, how's Redux going? Sorry, I had to leave. I was having so much fun. Only someone told you about the lava. Well, that's the thing. Is like I was looking for rising lava and none of it was rising, so I thought we were fine. Rising and so is the liquid levels in your bladder. Yeah, that's right. You want those to go down. 
like, like in that direction. Uh... Okay, see, if I can avoid jumping across lava to get this, that'd be cool. I don't think that I'm in danger to nade jump like this. To cheese that. Yeah, that's... That's nice. Oh, then the other the one's down there. All right, fuck it. To go around anyway. No, I don't. <laughs> oh, leave me alone. <gasps> God damn, that made me jump. Okay, there's a ladder. That there candy makes the whole deal worthwhile. <sighs> you know what? Fuck this DLC, dude. I'm never doing this again. Okay. Okay, we good? Uh. Can I just. Yeah, okay. That works for me. Scary as blood or there has ever been. Yeah, dude, doing what, like this side content is in a one life. I have never felt this way about this DLC before. Anyway, hey, Watsi, how are you? Good to see you. Um, what's up, Sirens Flame? Um, hello. Excuse me, blue name. Navhawk, good to have you. Hey, Donan, how's your morning or evening for you? Um, if you don't know me, I'm Mopey. Uh, I play this particular Borderlands most of all. Um, recently released the Loot Rando mod, uh, which shuffles every assigned source in the game. Um, you know, things like instead of getting the Lady Fist from the Uncle Teddy mission, you know, you can actually, like, farm it, uh, from Savage Lee or whatever. Instead of giving, getting your Herald from Savage Lee, you know, you have to go kill Hyperius for it because it gets assigned to Hyperius in your seed because fuck you. Um, and it's wonderful. This mod came out better than we ever could have imagined. Like, the ramifications of having encouragement to do every piece of content in the game to find all of the loot again. Slash, you get to level while using different loot than you do in every playthrough because, you know, it, Vanilla BL Borderlands only gives you, you know, the same loot as part of your progression normally. Um, this has turned out to be a lot of fun. We're doing it as a one life, um, uh, so that I can actually get enjoyment out of one life again. <laughs> um, you know, not having the same, every one life run be the same route, same progression every time. Yeah, right, so in this seed, we get the Layuda from Enchanted Skeletons. And Enchanted Skeletons are generous because you only get them, or at least I thought, you only get them as part of a very long mission. So every time you want an Enchanted Skeleton, you have to do, like, the entire Headhunter from start to finish. Side note, that's another feature, is that um, since mission rewards get assigned items, every single side mission in the game becomes repeatable. Loot Rando makes every mission repeatable uh, so that um, you can actually farm things instead of uh, only getting them once or having to read-only farm them. Like Headhunters. This Headhunter is repeatable. The whole thing, start to finish. Okay, this one's not so bad. Just as long as there's no enemies to knock you back. Or that. Hey, Deceptics, how you doing? Good to see you. Is the sketchy one? No, I thought, I figured, I found the one that was like, you know, in the porch or whatever. In the low, in, uh, hanging off the cliff to be the real bad one. This one's alright. How does that weapon drop? Is that the Moxie weapon? Oh no, I'm doing that. Just as an idle thing. It's faster than swapping weapons. Uh, and it's faster than reloading. You can just drop swap. And um, besides being faster, it's actually genuinely more fun. You know, it's, it's like an extra layer of input that you, uh, you're responsible for if you want to earn that faster. 
Depending on, you know, what you find fun. Oi. Whoop. Right, try again. There's probably a more correct way of getting up here, but this is the way that I know. Hey, you got enough time to keep No, Specs Page isn't up to date. Sorry about that. I'm on a um 13700K nowadays. I'm in a um O11 Air Mini case. Got a um Asus uh Z790 Mobo. I'll update that eventually. What were you looking for? Hey, Egg White. Doing good, dude. How's it going with you? Oh, also, I'm on a full custom loop now. I got I got that 3070 underwater. She quiet. Yes, that's right. My MOBO is only for those who dare, like me. Build yourself, yeah. Love building PCs. I do it all the time if I could afford it. Okay, cool. This is wonderful. This seed has nothing in it. We never have to do any of this shit again. All right, let's go beat Opportunity. Let's go beat Bunker. Let's win the video game. Yeah, still the 3070. It's a really good 3070. Um, uh, the, um, I, I'm, I'm lucky enough to have gotten, you know, an EVGA, uh, GPU before, um, they dissolved their partnership with NVIDIA. It's great, it's got a 300 power limit, I could absolutely up, get away with a higher power limit, um, but I couldn't find a BIOS that was compatible, like, I tried flashing, like, the Strix overclock BIOS onto it to up the power limit even further. But no, it's cool, it's cool. I get a lot out of my 300. So like, anyway, as far as um, 3070s go, it's fantastic. It'll last me many years to come. A fantastic day for capitalism. Merci to say farewell, please. Since that's a Hyperion purple pistol, it will still rarely get E-Tech. No, I actually specifically fixed that. I got rid of that. Um, <laughs> here, I'll show you, check it out. Uh, catalog, uh, Hyperion. Pistol. Um, I made a specific class just for that item um, that uh, gets rid of the extra barrels. It only chooses um, barrels up through index 8, uh, non inclusive, to get rid of the superfluous E Tech ones. Oh. Um, I don't want to go about body double quickly and cleanly. What was our fastball anyway? Which we should have on 40. Hmm, that might be it. Or that. Hey, Sleepy Catherine. Nice to meet you. How's it going? Like angels, <clears throat> and hey, two molds. How you doing? Asus was in hot water for a bit. I was cooking the latest gen Ryzen. Yeah, no. Believe, it, believe me. I'm actually not the biggest fan. I got this one secondhand uh, from a friend, bless Kale. Um, and actually, you know, doing the research, it is uh, this Z790 board is good. The VRMs are good. I have a underclock on my 13700K just to bring the temps down and the performance up a little bit. Um, so I'm not worried about the cooking possibility at all either. 
your mommies and daddies gave up so your family could live did i forget the one i think i did no i didn't never mind your family is paid to be here i'm the one who feeds and protects everyone remember we should all love our parents but love me more <laughs> Did you know littering and opportunity is punishable by death? If not, you also ought to know complaining about opportunity flaws. That's alright, but I'm good. Eating a barbecue littering. chicken pizza with pineapple and jalapeno. Yeah, that's pretty good. Ugh, get out of that, dude. Is that orc buff launcher? Yeah, that's what that was. Right. <laughs> Asus was in hot water. Do you mind? Now grab the voice modulator. Great. Now, unfortunately, you will speak in Jack's voice give up. until you reach the security. You're a failure. Just give up. Yeah, that's right. Oh, come on! Don't hit me. Oh my god, now we gotta kill all of opportunity. You seriously thought you could hide from me, Angel? Is that what you thought? Say goodbye to your friend, Angel. Say it. See you soon. TVHM feels a bit clunky. Yeah, I actually, um, I consider TVHM to be the hardest difficulty. Harder than UVHM, because in UVHM, um, uh, you always have access to what you need. Like, you do your TVHM prep, get your level 50 loadout, you've got a complete build that isn't missing anything. And then, you know, that's enough of a foothold to get to the point in UVHM where you can keep that same, uh, complete loadout going. You never have to, like, be without. TVHM, it's in this, like, weird middle point where you don't actually have that many skill points. And, man, skill points, you know, are, like, a huge factor in how powerful you are. Even when, you know, you're going up against UVHM difficulty, they make all the difference. They make the game easier. By means of, you know, you being powerful. Uh, and also, you know, as you progress through TVHM, um, you have such a, like, spotty access to gear uh, due to the level scaling. Spend more time in TVHM farming gear and XP than you do playing the game. That too. Yeah, yeah. We have a shot of I got auto modded. Oh no, we just we just filter at Mopioid. You can. It's it's not actually like you did anything wrong. I just no highlighting messages because I read every single message I possibly can anyway. No special treatment. Anyway, what'd you say? <laughs> what side quest do you recommend to stay on level in TVHM? Life and I are only 38. Wildlife is 42. So actually, the side quest that I would probably recommend would be a DLC. DLCs are just big, gigantic side quests, um, like any other. Except they're big and gigantic. Um, they give you gear, they give you XP, you know, just like main game things um oh man hold on i am like out of vape fluid i gotta refill this bottle that'll last me um have you guys done any dlcs in normal mode yet you know just do things that you haven't done yet DLC didn't scale. No, so the way that they work, um, actually, it's a little weird in co-op, but in rule of thumb is um, they just match the level that you are when you enter them. Um, headhunters are going to be useless to you because they're just one map, and in co-op, the first map of every DLC scales to minimum level for that playthrough. Because, thanks, Gearbox. Thanks for making co-op like that for some reason. Um... But, like, for, like, full campaign DLCs, um, they'll still be a good experience. The first map will have weird levels for missions. 
the enemies will still scale to you, so, you know, it'll be, like, you know, good, fun, normal content that gets you XP. But then as you, um, you know, go further in the DLC, it'll be back to normal, even in co-op. <laughs> Time to get a grog. Yeah, there you go. There's a... There's an example, sure. Time to get a sword explosion. Minion, I started my attack. I'm gonna drag every inch of this mountain if it's the last thing I do. Let's go. Hey, what are we killing Bunker with exactly? We are gonna make Jack regret ever setting up shop on this cliff. That level 40 we'll corrosive Layuta maybe might be fastest. Minutes, I say. <laughs> Especially if we orc it. <laughs> gub. I sacrificed the gub. You know, for a greater purpose that turned out to not be so great. Hey, Wait, we didn't miss any checks in Hollowed Hollow, did we? Uh, we're looking for you. Troll F. Um, bloody Harvest. Layuda, Fireball, Hellfire, E-Tech Pistol, mag Blue Magic Missile, Hyperion Pistol. Okay, fine. Yeah. Oh, right. You're not a Hyperion robot. I forget that sometimes. Wish my SO would play Borderlands with me. <laughs> Marlene, my wife wishes her SO would play Borderlands with her. I, um... She wants to, like, experience all of the content in the Borderlands franchise. And I'm like, yeah, we'll do that, and then, you know, never really get around to it. Sorry. Sorry, babe. Oh, you made it past the security wall, huh? That's, uh, it's real cute. Hope he's a backseat gamer. No, I'm good about that. I'm just, um, I sit there impatiently. Not backseating, but being impatient. Um, actually, that's really not ideal. Yeah, it is. Hmm. Right, kill skills. Yeah, I didn't really get anything boss killing. So, constructors are gonna be rough. I should probably... Oh wait, we have do or die. Nerf do or die. We should probably uh, just whip out again the corrosive Layuta for the badass constructor. Hell, should whip out the corrosive Layuta for the frickin' door turrets. Do or die is so bust. Oh my god, dude, seriously, nerf do or die. Thirty-eight. Ugh, gross. What else do I have? We didn't do a whole lot of prep for this, because really, you know, I'm just, I've been looking towards what everything that we get after Bunker. Bunker himself is going to be a little scraping by. Get to know Jack! Gave me a baby maker! Oh, nice! <laughs> Didn't want to know him that well. <laughs> you, <laughs> you really got to see another side of Jack there. Yeah, yeah whatever. That reset our fight for a lifetime, so that's nice. I think we'll be okay for quick bunker kill in the end. Hey! Hey, you know how I got my hands on that ball key? 
It's <laughs> <That's> a level <laughs> 38 Lyuda, dude. Well, Fucking Axton. Hey, did you know Axton's weak? Orc does that. Yeah, Orc does that with the help of Axton, right, exactly. They show mercy. Orc is dumb. Orc's really not dumb. Um, if you try to do that with normal, even UVHM swap speed, that nothing happens. Just nothing happens. It's just a build synergy. Um, Zero can get a stack or two. Um, Krieg, if, you know, you invest um, exclusively into a build and play style, uh, can get a few stacks. Axton just gets a few stacks. Like, consistently. Alright, fun time's over, kitties. Breaking his mouth breathers couldn't bust... Probably smartest to stick to sniper here. Stick to range. First, do your thing. Good job. Axton doesn't even have an explosion or cloud killer boar. Impossible. Yeah, right, exactly. The Axton doesn't have anything broken. Right. Man, I've heard that one a lot. The idea that um, boar is what defines zero and the lack of boar is what then defines a character like Axton. I'm gonna go this way. Oh yeah, no, no, it's not to say that boar isn't good, it's just that to think that, like, Zero is good because of boar, because, you know, that's what you've seen of him on YouTube or whatever. Because of CA. Yeah, Zero's real defining skills are CA, uh, Deception itself, uh, and Two Fang. I'd say those are the three big ones. I keep wanting to swap between one and three, but that's wrong. Yeah, Deception by itself, really. Like, Zero's probably the strongest level 5 character because of Deception. Like, Zero, Zero gets more of a power spike just from his action skill than any other characters do, you know, without any other skills to support. Phase Lock's good too, but more situational. The turret is good too, but, um, more, uh, cooldown. <laughs> Many Must Fall gets your vote. See, I'd say that Many Must Fall is, like, Zero's funnest skill, but not 
his uh, most OP uh, 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 ranking tier defining skill. And that's not to say it's not very, very powerful. It's just not, you know, Melee Zero isn't, like, critical ascension powerful. Do it. Uh, you really think I'd protect Angel with nothing but a couple of bots and some flimsy turrets? The same thing, like, Rick's is just, bunker right like, hella long the bunker and you don't have any other stuff. Those space pants. Luscious. Your butt is space. Your butt is just space. The bunker. Thanks, the Luscious. Are the greatest defense bot ever built. Designed to myself. <laughs> now do me a favor and How you die. doing, man? <laughs> Happy anniversary, Whoa. honey. Boo. Oh yeah, true. Death mark. Yeah. Got him. Uh, that's not death cycle. Ah. Ah. Should have been a two cycle, one cycle, whatever. on a different gun in case we need it. Electric <laughs> Kunai are pretty underrated. Well... I mean, besides obviously the deathmark application, Kunai itself doesn't really do anything. Um, late game, except kill you, if you fuck up. You can make him do damage. Um, you know, roid boosted kunai are useful for melee zero. But aside from whittling an enemy closer to the point where you can chain many must fall off them, um, really all they do at end game is kill you if you get hit by them. The, the elemental explosions part. I'm nearly there, soldier. I'm climbing up the rear. Where's Kunai? I mean, everyone caused the death on zero. Yeah, right, right. Hey, hey, Superfly. How you doing, dude? Nuke is mid. What nuke is for is for the aggro aspect of the turret. You throw a nuke, and um, immediately the nuke knocks back every enemy it hits, which gives you a moment of reprieve. But it also applies a fire dot to all of those enemies. And the fire dot ticking, every tick of the fire dot is an opportunity for uh, those enemies to switch aggro to the turret. It's a huge aggro boon. It's, it's you know, obviously useless for damage. But um, for using the turret for its strength, which is, you know, Axton getting to run around completely free of, like, danger because everything's attacking the turret instead of him, it's stupidly important. And apparently it gets results from the boost, man. Yeah, can't forget that. Yeah, true. Iridium alone could never charge the vault key. It needs a catalyst, something to awaken its power. Could it's only good because it applies death mark, basically never slags. Yeah, no, it doesn't you can't use it for slag. Full volley of kunai on a single target will often not slag them. Um I wouldn't say it's only useful for applying death mark. Uh again, it is useful for melee zero where you strip your you have a fat target and you wouldn't be able to kill them in one shot to be able to chain many must fall. But if you strip your shield, then kunai them um, to lower their health with, you know, roid-boosted kunai, and then melee them 
in one shot because of their lowered health value, then actually, like, the kunai damage has been really useful in that case. But yeah, that's that's kind of a narrow circumstance, you know, like, if you're trying to chain many must fall off a uh, badass or whatever. What's up with the weapon drop? Well, okay, so it's just a habit, but it is useful for swapping weapons quickly. And also, every time you do it, it reloads your weapon. Okay, I'm gonna play this conservatively. It's just Angel Score, but you know. For nuke over double up? Mm -hmm. I prefer nuke over slag turret, that's for sure. <clears throat> um, at that point, typically I have a slagging method anyway. Yeah, no, double up. Double up is like, out of all of Axton's ways of slagging, double up is the worst. It's so slow, and it's so much slower than Axton. Like, it doesn't fit his playstyle at all, you know? Axton playing very quickly, because all of his actions are very quick. And then you're waiting on the turret to slag things, like, once every four or five seconds or something. When, you know, he swaps weapons as fast as he does, and carries as many nades as he does. Yeah, that's the thing, is, like, expertise is, like, what makes Axton fun. Skills like expertise. Good. Okay, well, I don't want that. A lot of people, me included, made the mistake of trying to build for explosive dead. Yeah, yeah, you hear that phrase a lot explosive accident. Even though, um, Axon doesn't have one single explosive buff. Um, that's not Axon's fault, or any- or the player's fault. That's, um, Borderlands 2's fault for having really confusing, uh, mechanics when it comes to element versus splash. Versus grenade versus explosion. Like, unless you, you know, like, deep dive that shit like a huge nerd, you know, how are you supposed to know the difference between grenade or explosive, you know? Demonite, right, exactly. I had to learn all that shit from Demonite. Specifically. Not from Borderlands 2. You know what? Do your thing. I'll wait. <laughs> That's right, yeah, yeah, Bunny. That's another one. Even, like, veteran players who have, like, learned about the mechanics of, like, grenade splash versus launcher splash versus gun splash, um, some of the ramifications of those deep dive things are still yet further less obvious. Bunny emote just learned today that when an accident skill says it buffs launcher damage, that doesn't mean any gun that counts as launcher splash. No, that literally just means guns that use rocket launcher ammo. 
an injector bring you back from fight for your life? No, but these things do. That's why I leave these alive. I'll go catch the Pokemans. I'll be lurking for my heaven. All right, cool. Have fun, dude. Thanks again. Good to have you. Watch this. It's fun. Yeah, it's fun deep diving this stuff. Totally. I like soaking up the trivia. But it's like it it makes the game unnecessarily hard for the, you know, new player. That's why you hear things like explosive accidents so much, you know. That's It's not going to get someone who's um, trying to like experience accident anywhere. are fine. Orc is fine. Calculus doesn't hold a candle to some of the Madden games. I mean, yeah, Calculus is about, like, learning intuition. Mechanics and, like, Borderlands math in some games, you know, is more about, you know, like, memorizing trivia. You know, you don't have to, like, develop a mental model for limits and derivatives. You just have to memorize slots and formulas. Lurking while I smuggle illegal artifacts in Freelancer. Oh. Are there authorities in Freelancer that I should be alerting? One said multiple. Right, exactly. Memorization, right? Well, that was boring, but smooth. Thank you guys for keeping me company while we did Angel's Core. Yeah, Gwen's head has type B. I, it's not entirely helpful to say multiplicative. Because, like, for example, two Gwen's heads, crit bonuses, would be additive with each other's. Also, there's the Grog. That's in the same place in the formula. A Grog plus a Gwen's head would be additive. A Grog plus a Grog would be additive. Um, so, like, you know, it's, it's more useful to divide them into categories and whatever terms you want to use for that. The old school term is type A versus type B. Most crit damage, uh, crit bonuses are type A. Uh, some select ones are type B. All type A's add to each other. All type B's add to each other. And then the cumulative type A's multiply the cumulative type B's. Yeah. Oh no, Kevin Hart. Yeah. No, this game doesn't have Kevin Hart Roland. BL1 has Kevin Hart Roland. I'm trying to think of what to call this Roland. Oh no, someone who really shouldn't be an actor. Okay, that was mean. Yeah. What the? How the hell did you get back there? Oh, friggin' both of Oh, we have two of these. Son of a bitch. Rub me blind. Okay. Uh. I like that we turn 48. Is Sanctuary 48 or is. Yeah, no, Sanctuary can be 48. 
in TVHM. I feel wrong. This device Jack's using on me. I feel Hey, Slab. Oh, Roland. Yeah, Roland. Okay. We get to relax and get a real much needed power spike. Um, let's actually respec for run fast so we can get a good one. Okay. Blip. Wait, wrong thing. Oh, no, it's not. What's up, guys? And then how do I skip this? Yeah. Oh, wait! <laughs> it just worked. That's Garbo. Oh no, Stone Cold Steve Austin Roland! Steve Austin's an actor? I know The Rock is an actor, and oh man, if you talk shit about The Rock's talent, I swear to god. Supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Uh, you, you kill him. You kill him. Screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If um, you want to do me a solid and shut does this skip it? So I can get back to my nap. That, nope. No, that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which is really good at playing the rock. Next playthrough will be exposed. Very good. Yeah. Oh. Guess Jim did steal the cash. But we were. Will you freely respect? Oh my god, dude, totally. That's like my number one piece of advice to new players is just respec constantly. Like, no hesitation. Try everything. Mess around with everything. Trial and error. Fall on your face. Respec. It's like free for all intents and purposes. You should never feel any hesitation to mess around. Get a feel for your character. Find something that works for you. Find something that works for them. But also, yeah, for us, like, veteran players, dude, just skill points are the funnest part of the game, man. Like, you know, theory crafting your build is, um, you know, why I'm able to just keep playing this with, uh, new game characters. Still to this day. Oh wait, we didn't turn in. I mean, that's a good thing. Hold on, see what happens. He's here. Oh, she's not interactable. I should fix that. Time for me to go to work. All right, see you. Have a good one at work. Zass. Nice hanging. <laughs> I don't have. Oh, here. Let me do this. What's up? Uh, Vault Hunter? Little help. Look, it's a long story. You know. It's a short story. If I had. Like a hive or a Tunguska or a storm or something, I could probably farm these guys faster. Like, I could kill this guy while his health bar was still green. Wouldn't even need the mission. Elden Ring, you can't respec more than 10 times. Interesting. I'm sure they had a reason for that design theory. But what was it? Yes, wow. We but we were, we're only at not so slow, but damn. Maybe we learned something. Yeah. 
calf. We learned that Jim stole the cat. See, that's one that I would want to use if we, um, you know, maxed out Quick Charge. Thank you both yeah, no. Wait, Sam! In Diablo 2, you have to acquire rare drops to craft a respec item. Yeah, see, me personally, I'm not a fan, but I don't know those games well enough to comment on whether that's good design for them or not. What do you think? supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots also, he still pissed, by the way. How's it going? Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that know that only one of them will tell you the truth. So, like, the three is the limitation because if you were to able to, like, respec with, like, full uh, liberty awesome. in that game, it would give you some kind of undue advantage, like, respecing, um... Huh too optimized for narrow circumstances anytime you wanted. What caused you to be able to repeat the mission? Yeah, loot, that's a feature of loot rando. Oh my god, I did it again. Loot rando, you know, um, uh, assigns items that you want to farm to mission rewards, and uh, to allow you to actually farm them, it then makes every mission repeatable. In the Soul series, your build is also dependent on weapon upgrades, levels... Boost your stats, strength, stamina, health, etc. Mainly use weapons. Okay. You're not implying that you can respec all of those things. Like, what's a respec in Dark Souls? Exactly. Teaching your wife Diablo 2 Remaster. Oh, man. Was your vision for her to nerd out about it as hard as you have? Huh. Guess Jim did steal the cash. Attribute points. Okay, so that's like stat, strength, stamina, health, etc., right? Those attributes. Yeah, okay. Hey, Fade. How's it going? And hey, Buckets. How are you? It's a short story. I like short stories. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Respec in Souls games is resetting your attributes to the base stats. Reset them. Sure, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that doesn't, to me, seem game breaking, being able to do that on the fly. No, that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me. That's just, yeah, I like, I'm imagining awesome. having that. Huh. Okay. Jim did steal the cash, but we it's a lot friends. faster. That's sad. And it's not terrible special, we but we could probably yeah, we that Jim stole the do a little better. I'm willing to go a little longer. It's not game breaking. It just lets you try different builds. Yeah, right, right. So why the limitation? What was their theory there, do you think? Sorry, I was going to say, I'm imagining... Oh my god, that was terrible. Uh, you know, myself in that situation, and, you know, like, the, the outcome of it makes me feel like I should never respec, because every time I respec, I'm consuming something irreplaceable. You know, like, like, it's, um, uh, like, using an ether. I might never get, you know, another ether. Is this the right time to use this ether? 
And, you know, you've accumulated, like, 30 ethers because you just refuse to use them. Um, but, you know, it's because of that mental block of this not being a readily renewable resource that it never feels like the right time to use it. So you just never use it. You could ever fully justify it. And I don't like that feeling. I, I feel like that's, you know, a flaw in game design when that happens. get more when you go to get right right sure but um you know the the phenomenon that i'm referring to where you have a finite resource and therefore never allow yourself to feel like it's the right time to use that finite resource it's not really about like how many times you get it you know it's just if it's finite it's finite We're talking about not using ethers makes me think you secret. No, so Moby taught using that example was a uh, reference to Pro ZD. No, we are not taking a 32% one. Oh my god. I did it again. Definitely speaking, Dark Souls is a JRPG. Uh, is that, uh, based on its, like, you know, specific mechanics, or based on the fact that the company is Japanese? What's this definition, technically? Probably trying, yeah, 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 you know, you know, I think you might be right. I'll start doing that, every time. I'll just, good thing, good thing we figured that out. I'm sorry, Japanese. Not Japanese. Right, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. It's a short story. I write short stories. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid... It's like the idea of morons, permanence being so impactful. Decisions you make having real and sometimes game-breaking consequences. Okay. Liars, if you could figure out which one of them robbed the other... Yeah, no, I do appreciate... Giving greater impact to decisions that you make as a positive thing. Huh. Guess Jim did steal the cat. So long as it never gives you that paralysis of feeling like, um, you know, you're, you're constantly having to fear decisions that you make, you know what I mean? Risky launch, <laughs> true. <laughs> yeah, maybe I shouldn't hit grenade jumps with uh, Onslaught active in this direction. How long do you think the story is? We were supposed to divide the take four ways. Somebody up and nicked it before we split it up. Cyberpunk 2077 is only one respect per playthrough. Game is kept together by good wishes and chewing gum. I mean, I've heard great things about Cyberpunk these days. I'm sure it's more than just good wishes and chewing gum. But man, that sounds awful. I personally, and you know, this doesn't necessarily apply to everybody, but I would hate that. Jokes on you, I already fear every decision I make. <laughs> Fair. Sure, that's just better. Hey, let's sell some of these. Oh, that's even just better. Okay. Rifleman, one of the few actually really desirable purple comms in the game. Cool to have a farm for it like this. Uh, Vault Hunter? Little help? Look, it's a long 
The random seed that I got on my accident playthrough gave me the easiest Norfleet farm I've ever seen. It was what's in the box! <gasps> okay, forget the fact that, you know, you have a source of Norfleets. Bro, how did they fit that Norfleet in that box? You know, you look at a box that size, and when you ask yourself what's in the box, you assume that it's going to fit in that box. It's bigger on the inside. Yeah, there you go. Jim did steal the cash. Yeah, we That's sad. That's sad. Hey, Jamwell. Good to see you again. Winterfleet Farm is the Fire Marcus mission. Ugh. Should have nerfed him harder. <laughs> That's gross. Right, I was going to say the box isn't blue. It's a short story. I write short stories. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. <laughs> I only found a corrosive <laughs> weapon. Good. If you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap. This mod is making you crave a fresh playthrough. Oh, I hope you like it. Enjoy, enjoy. The Marcus uh, Elemental Visions are OP. Yeah, so I did do a small nerf to them. Huh. Uh, which is... Again, but emphasis we on small. Uh, the mission no longer provides you with the elemental weapons to do the mission with. You have to go find your own. So, depending on the luck of your seed, you kind of have to earn them. You don't just get them all at once the moment you get to Sanctuary. Um, at least, you know, you'll be able to do the fire one when you first get to Sanctuary, but if you haven't been so lucky as to get a, uh, weapon that's locked to shock, and a weapon that's locked to corrosive, and a weapon that's locked to slag, um, by the time you get to Sanctuary, then you can't do all of them. You get them, like, kind of staggered one at a time as you discover other elements after Sanctuary. If you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get Again, very small nerf, but at least it's something. At least, you know, it increases the excitement of, like, unlocking the missions one at a time, not all at once, and, uh... Okay, we already got that one. Hello, Carson. Good to see you. Um... And also, you know, it gives you a little bit of extra excitement. Like, if you get a Dominator or a Commerce, um, you know, and they are your first weapons of those elements, um, they're exciting. You know, it's like, oh, okay, this gun sucks, but I can use it to unlock a Marcus mission and see that amazing check. You know? I got sad because I used to take a slag mission for slag. Yeah, see, that's actually another, like, side boon is, um, you can no longer subvert your seed. If your seed hasn't given you slag that early, then you don't get slag that early just by picking up the Marcus mission, you know? Yeah, like, we all do that in vanilla. But it's more fun to go outside of your normal vanilla route and roll with the randomness of loot rando. Guess Jim did steal the cash. But we were friends. Okay, I'm thinking we're probably just going to roll with this. Um, and we'll get a, you know, more better one at level 50 in preparation of UVHM. But yeah, we got a perfect rifleman. We got a... Well, we'll probably get another one of those at 52. We got a totally, totally wonderful antagonist. Let's move on. We can get Phalanx or a point in quick charge. Um, but no, not now. Okay. 
Mal missions. We want to get through all the Mal missions because the last one gives Butcher. Is our current kit... Does our current kit give us enough confidence to do that? I'd say probably, yeah. We need to get limbs. To oh, and hey, we can do Geary now! What if we what if we do Geary now? Well, we could die to Geary again, just like we did in the Zero at first bad. first attempt. Okay, let's do it. Hold on. Actually, first let me use the restroom. I'll be right back, and then Iridium Blight. Do 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 Gary sounds fun. Oh, just wait until we do the whole unbreakable gear. <laughs> right now, um, we're just going to go kill Gary himself. You know, he's. He's a, uh, a sign drop. Oh, wait. Uh, we should talk to Mel. Along the way. Get li uh, What does he want first? Clothes? Oh my god, we're gonna get him so many clothes? It'll be a fun mod. A mod that changes all the legendary effects to be attached to barrels, so that hybrids would be possible again. Uh, well, so that's already how it works. Hi. For like 99% of guns, is, kind of is like, just by merit of having the barrel on the gun, uh, that is what grants the special effect. Um, the mod would have to allow, uh... Um, guns to spawn with multiple barrels to make them hybrids. And that would I not be hard. And I don't like that. Could you help me become human? Maybe I could wear clothes, but I see humans wearing clothes. Normal mode scaled barrels. When was the last one life playthrough? Uh, a long time ago. I got very sick of doing the same thing every time we did one life. We got a zero win. And then I was, um, you know, grinding out Sal win. And, you know, we, we got, like, OP-10 Sal runs, and then I just got fucking bored. Damn it! Jack doesn't want us getting close to him. Brick, you got a plan to get to the stockade? Blow stuff up! That's my plan! Vault Hunter, get the Sawtooth Cauldron. Anyway, um, since, uh, Loot Rando came out, we've been doing it again. This Loot Rando is exactly what I needed to enjoy. Uh, wait. Oh, we have Malmission selected, that's why. Loot Rando is exactly what I needed to enjoy, um, One Life again. Let me fill up on Nate's. So we have a win. Yeah, yeah. Again, you know, I would have liked to have gotten the Sal one so we could be like one of the three people ever or whatever. Uh, to have two wins. But I just, I couldn't. I wasn't enjoying it. Uh, 
y'all. Turret is pain town. Oh yeah, we're good. Did y'all know that like bandit shotguns are just insane, and like you know you should use them whenever you get them. And in loot rando, if you get a source for them, you should just farm them. So, yeah, that's right. I'm gonna be the first one to get a loot rando win with this seed. <laughs> Using Sligo plus Bandit Shotgun on my one lifestyle right now. They're so good. They seriously are. It might, it might be the most underrated weapon type, Bandit Shotguns. Between all of the uniques that are never used, even though they're some of the best items in the game, and the non-uniques that are some of the best items in the game. Bandit shotgun, most underrated genre. Hey, Alexi, good to see you. Got a Norfleet from Michael. You know what? Good. Uh, you deserve your Norfleet farm to be that bad. Rock salt, Jolly Roger, dog. Don't forget, um... Uh... Sledges, dude, every single bandit shotgun is good. Just every single one. How's Teeth? Teeth is probably the least good one, but still a good one. Uh, teeth is, um, actually, like, really good in the, like, limited circumstances in which you sweet spot with it consistently. I don't trust that collision at all. Yeah, banded SMGs, and you know I rant about banded SMGs being mediocre. Banded SMGs are the least mediocre of the non-unique SMGs. Um, besides plasma casters. Like, you know, if you're uh, leveling a Maya, out of all of the SMGs, random SMGs to just pick up off the ground, their choice. We made it. No death! Make it worth it! Unless I'm crazy, I don't think he listened. If that was Merv, I'd be happy, except Merv is a, um... ...farm that needs to be faster because it's part-specific. Someday, we'll get a, um, Axton run where we get, like, Merv, Bandit Merv from, um, uh, the Lasko puddle or something, so we can actually run Nate Axton with Bandit. What are you doing, Unbreakable Gear? That's not available until after Warrior, right? Okay. This I consider to be safety, so I feel legit safe quitting there. Or is Unbreakable Gear available now? Right? It's after Warrior, right? In TVHM? Okay, I take it back. We're doing it after Butcher. 
after we get our butchers and are nice and geared, we're doing it. Oh my god, actually, now I'm, like, really excited. <laughs> Unbreakable? Yeah, do you do you know the Lord of the Rings Easter egg? Uh, secret mission thing? I should have a name. Humans have names. I bet I'm malfunctioning like the dickens, so... This is level 49. I'm not complaining. Uh, FaceTime, yeah. Nah? Alright, well, stick around. You'll see it. Uh, okay, back to Sawtooth. Transition out again. <coughs> Longest mission in the game? I don't know. It's a good question, actually. You think so? The actual longest? Nah, surely there's something longer. I don't actually have, like, a good mental model for how long exactly it takes start to finish. Um, and whether, you know, is, is it on the order of, like, half an hour? 20 minutes? Well, let's time it. Yeah, totally. Dude, today has just been, like, lava day. Shit's stressful. Uh, I guess just grenade jump and pick that up, people said. Good geared Zelda. Yeah, dude! Deceptics, you still here? Has anyone ever, like, you know, had at least the meme idea to time Geary's Unbreakable Gear? <laughs> to me, that seems like a great meme misc category, but, um... You know, maybe not as good as- Ow! Oops. <laughs> nice. Maybe not as good as, like, um... Uh... You know, running headhunters geared, or, um... Sanctuary hole geared. I don't like that that guy is shooting me from afar with a rocket launcher. Okay. I can't wait to try them out. Come on back. The line of sight. Uh, yes, line of sight. Heck. I think it will save quit for Gunzerk sounds awful. Well, yeah, but like that would be routing, um, you know, yippee Kaye, procs, and to a lesser extent, hopefully, get some procs. You know, you like route around enemies. 
Okay, but I, I understand the difference, you know, with that and other geared categories. Restack EV. Yeah, there you go. Actually, shit. You know, that's not even the worst idea. That wouldn't make the category fun, though. Turn into a multi-shotting exercise, which is cool, but not as fun. Sure, okay, yeah. Right, since so many just, like, you know, straight shots, long distances, it would just be how well can you do big launches. and desire things. I'm in credit card debt and have a wife. Hi. I've come to a realization. Thank you for helping me. Once I've thank you for helping me. Once I've murdered you. Okay. Let's do it. How do we what's our fastest setup for this? Fastball? Maybe? Yeah. No, not fastball. Ow! That hurt. Wait, humans feel pain. Forty-nine. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> Ooh. I'm human. I'm human. Yay! This is the best day of my life. Hmm. Well, we'll do the shotgun then. I don't think we're really gonna stack orc. Uh, backup, I guess. Yeah. Man, why doesn't he have crit spots? Ow! That hurt. Wait. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must mean I'm human. I was slow too. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe that's our best bet. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must mean I'm human. Uh, yeah, here. No? Sweet spot? Ow! Okay. That hurt! Wait! Humans feel pain! I felt pain! That <laughs> Where are you hoping for? Uh foregrip? And then I would like a fire foregrip and a corrosive foregrip. <laughs> so this is gonna be a bit of a farm, but you know. Oh my god, is the butcher just worth it? Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That... Ammo. Hey, we could do. Oops. No. We do want to. Since this is 49, again, that's a good thing. But it does mean that I need to hit 49 before Sawtooth. 
Um, you know what? Actually, why don't we go ahead and work while we wait? It's something to do. Hopefully he doesn't break. I fixed him. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. I, think I, am doing very well in this I agree, Mal. Wait, humans feel pain. Uh, we do need to hit 49 before Sawtooth so that we can actually use these things. Which means, you know, we'll do some content or something. Um... Oh, right. To, uh... Get some... Farm some knowledge and get some XP. We did, um... Gobbler in normal mode, right? That wasn't TVHM, that was normal mode. What would he, what did we get out of Gobbler? Gobbler. Alright, E-Tech AR, E-Tech Launcher. Right. Oh man, that's a hell of a farm though, because mission enemy. Hunchy, Gwen's Head, Rapier, Orphan Maker, Jacob's AR, Gearbox Sniper, TD or Grenade. Uh, we don't know what Max gives yet, I guess. Um, E-Tech SMG. Actually, well, that would be kind of nice to get a TDR one, though. Banded Pistol, Gearbox Rifle, uh, Hyperion SMG. Uh, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Seraph item. We don't know what Annie gives. No, that was Meteor Shower. We do know. And I, you know, really wouldn't mind getting another. Cradle, Hammer Buster, Infection Cleaner, Fremington's Edge. All right. Oh, uh, Flacker, Little Eevee. Oh, you know, I'd love to run a Little Eevee, though. <coughs> and we haven't done Raid Difficulty yet. Unless we did. No, we did not do Raid Difficulty. Oh. Grandma's story gives the Little Eevee. Thanks, Grandma. All right, I'm tempted. Orked little Eevee in between um, turret cooldowns would be really cool. Uh, especially now that we are, you know, at the point where we actually have nade buffs. I got blockade and Big Boom Blaster for Mercenary Day. Oh, wow. <laughs> you know, you're actually the first person that um, has mentioned doing that content. Since, um, you know, in Lou Rando, it really doesn't have that many checks, which I consider to be a good thing, you know? Since um, that content isn't exactly within the realm of, hey, Lou Rando makes you do things you never do in vanilla, right? But anyway, I'm glad you got something good from it. There for the loot after boss. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, you're the first one. You mentioned it. <laughs> well, that was because you're doing DLC only, you weirdo. Ow! That hurt! Wait, you must feel pain. I felt pain. That must mean I'm... That's how you got the corrosive. You actually just did an entire headhunter just to get to my your job. Marcus mission crutch? Bro. <laughs> Joker's gonna have to enter that, yes. <laughs> Sorry, not, um, Marcus Mission Crutch. Ogre Crutch. This one is allowing me to enjoy not having ammo with the Wonderlust. <laughs> hey, Sparrow, how's it going? It's all felt for your corrosive. Yeah, no, the, the way that, you know, you react to that situation is just wait until you get a corrosive gun. You know? Corrosive gun starts spawning at like what, level 14 or something, maybe 13? Just play the game, use other gear. Don't crutch that one piece of gear. It's Lou Rando, you get so much different stuff to use. 
So, like, you know, keep playing, you know, eventually you will get the corrosive weapon just naturally. Until you do, you'll be having other types of fun. More different types of fun are good. Um, and then, you know, your reward for that will be getting to crutch your ogre for all of normal mode. Yeah. <laughs> or whatever. A brute force, the same build I use every time you cannot stop. Yeah, right, right, right. Hey, Ed Nacho, how's it going? Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must mean I'm. Okay, maybe we'll just go for um, neutral foregrip, because wow, this is taking longer than I thought it would. Hmm. On the plus side, we don't have to do this again after Warrior, because it's already 49. No variation. Ow! That hurt! Wait! Humans feel pain! I felt pain! That must mean I'm human! Out of Rook from Fire, so at level 13, I farmed Fire to get Slag and Caress, and then I got shocked from Sorry. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Those are our best so far. Fine. Cross the sniper is actually usable. Good part of Hyperion. You know, yeah. Um, you get like a something like a Hyperion sniper, which you would normally completely overlook, but at a time when you know you kind of need gear. And all of a sudden you're like, wait, actually this is working, and it's so different. That must mean I'm human! I'm human! You know, it's true of, like, the Cobra. You know, it's true of, um, frickin' Boom Puppy. It's true of Hyperion Snipers. There are good Hyperion Snipers. You know, you get one with Vladoff Barrel, and that offsets a lot of the problems that most Hyperion Snipers have. The fire rate and the mag. And, you know, you get it in purple gemstone, and that's as good as it can get, and, you know, it's that totally hurt. usable. Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must Do three pearls now. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Any good ones? Which pearls? Butcher, Sawbar, and Carnage. Oh, wow, you got three of the good pearls. Straight up. Wow, okay. Was your butcher from a source in which you could actually get a butcher that is a butcher? Great. That's our that practicable. I'm human. Great. I'm human. I'm human. It's from Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, well. Unless you're really committed. I wouldn't farm a butcher that is as good as a butcher from Boom. Yep, one of the ancients from your water pool. <laughs> hey, that's cool. Ow! That hurt! Wait. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. Yeah, my creek got like Storm, Avenger, Carnage. Oh, you got a Carnage source for a Krieg? Oh. The tree, that's the kind of thing that you can't do in vanilla. What are you going to do? Farm tubbies? To get a casual one? Ow, that no. Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. I consider Sawbar good. Sawbar's a sweet spot weapon, and it goes best with fire rate. Just stupid amounts of fire rate. Also, orc. <laughs> stupid amounts of orc. Is there a method to farming the pool? Exit and re enter the map. Don't seem to be getting. Oh, you have to wait a second after you enter. And a good rule of thumb is wait until. Oh, I don't think we. Whoops. Uh. Oh, we did do it. Oops. Wait until the save icon finishes. 
That's long enough. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. I pull items to Nasdity. Oh, too bad. Uh, what about your face, McShooty? You got that yet? No. You got a perfect carnage, 499 Reaper. That's fine. Just so long as you get uh, Legendary Reaper, Blue Blister, or Purple Blister, you're good. You're good to carnage. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must mean I'm human! <laughs> Why would I kill Jack with one clip for the peak? I mean, like, is that it? Yeah, right, right. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans when we were um, I felt pain. doing I the cataloging for Loot Rando, and, you know, just using the kill all button to get through everything and record all of the enemy pawns, you know, we pressed the kill all button on Jack. Such that... This invisible god force, you know, emerges from the heavens Ow, and just hurt. takes his entire existence away from him. I felt pain. And he says, is that it? Human. Huh? And it praise the face of a deity. Yeah, exactly. Right, right. Hey, 900 Rider. How you doing? Pico Bird is quickly becoming one of your favorites. Oh, first time? Playing, uh, getting it playing Roguelands and you're a bad mach- It's a bad machine. Ow! That hurts! Huh? Machine. Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must be- Haven't found your peak opener yet. These are my other vanilla characters. Cool. Yep. Yeah, no, in, in vanilla, the peak opener is almost too easy to get. Is that it? <laughs> Playing Krieg. Hey, cool. Welcome, customer. Ugh. No. Yeah. Those are like the same. Or the same better. Don't have much fun. Oh, right. Let me know if anything catches your eye. Lovely. Don't die. I yeah. need your business. I just learned right now that the warrior can kill you when it flops down the ground. Um. Yeah, that's been learned before. Ow! That hurt! Wait. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. Uh, that there was a, like um. Or oh, there is a. Very, very talented One Life player by the name of Duck. Who was doing their um, OP10 completion playthrough in their one life. And they saved Warrior for last. And having completed all of the other OP10 content and about to get their actual one life win. 
they died getting crushed by warrior. They were literally one mission turned in away from winning. And that killed them. Poetic? I don't know if I'd use that word. It's something. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. Hey Dusty, how you doing? I'd count it. Yeah, I mean, I think that, like, they've demonstrated that they are a one-life winner. For sure. 100%. I, I would never disagree with anyone that said that they've beaten one life. Ow, that hurt. But I don't think that that helps for them, pain. either, I you know. That must mean I'm them yelling. knowing that. Hey, Sir Duckus, how's it going? Thanks for the well wishes. <laughs> we were just talking about a duck. How's your Wednesday, friend? But yeah, no, the fact that it, they actually, like, had done all of the other content, literally the last thing that they needed to do was turn in the mission into the vault key on the ground. You know, that was it. They'd killed Warrior. They had done everything. It's incredible that, like, they managed to die on literally the very last check mark. That's all it was. It was a check mark. Like, it'd be one thing if it was, like, you know, oh, they still had to do draft DLC or, you know, they still had to do the OP-10 peak run. No, they had done everything. That was it. The, the question mark turn in on the ground. Kind of like Armando Galaraga. Galaraga? Galaraga? Sorry. He threw what would be the 25th perfect game in baseball history. That must mean I'm human! But the Empire blew the call on the final out. Calling the runner safe. This was before instant replay. Um... And that's, like, that's recognized as fact, that, like, it was a bad call. It wasn't close or, like, you know, up for debate. It just, it was bad. Oh, man. Ow, that hurts. That's different, because you have someone to hate in that circumstance. That must mean I'm human. Not everyone, oh, wow, okay. Even the runner. Mm. Yeah, that says something for sure. Or if the game was nearly in tears. Oh, not... Right, forget the, like, resentment towards the Umpire. Yeah, I can only imagine how the Umpire feels. Thank God for instant replay. What a good development. Ow, that hurt. Wait, Yay, let's just look back. Pain. I felt pain. You caught them all! <laughs> oh, is that what you're supposed to do with Pokemon? Oh, good. Nicely done. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. Yeah, there you go. Right, you get that achievement. Close this finish without finishing. <laughs> what are you farming for? Butcher. Uh, our um, clothes make the man. Oh, sorry. A real boy human. That's what it's called. Our a real boy human mission gives the butcher. Ow, that hurt. Wait, humans feel pain. 
really make him feel human? I mean, he seems to be enjoying, like, this human interaction. Like, like as a human... Oh, whoops. Um, this is a fun, you know, repeti repeated pastime for him. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. Move from farming gear, Borderlands 2, to completing a Pokedex on a modded version I'm playing. Oh, cool. Well, mod. Only modded Pokemon I ever played was, um, uh, Crystal Clear. Oh, man, that was a high-quality one. Not that I have much frame of reference, but I can feel the attention to detail. Humans feel pain. I felt pain. Oh, there we go. I don't know why the mission doesn't select when I pick it up. I wonder what causes that. All right. That must mean I'm human. Good enough. I'm human. I'm human. Yay! This is the best day of my Let's life. Let's go with good enough. Ugh, but man, I really wanted elements, especially because we have bones. Hey, what was our um? Two Fang relic, Shadow of the Seraphs. Out of body experience, turn in Doctor Zed. All right, and it would just be like twelve or something right now. Um, do I have Hyperion allegiance? No. Not that I know of, anyway. What would be a good relic to pair with this? <laughs> uh, build just a bone for the cooldown, I guess. Oh, man. Yeah, we give up so much not having them be of element. I think maybe the right choice is to do a shock one. The only one that hears the music? If I was the only one that hears the music, then how did you know that there's music, huh? Huh? Are you psychic? Are you reading my brain to know about the music? Shotgun aggression relic. I don't think that would be, uh, really amount to much. Let's see. 20%, 30%, 30%, and then adding another 20%. Oh, sorry, plus another 20%. Yeah, no, Shotgun Aggressive Relic wouldn't do shit. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain! Uh, the problem with the, um, Aggression Relics and why you never see anyone using them... Uh, is that they're just additive with other skills that say gun damage. Minus a few exceptions. Um, no kill like overkill, money shot, and reaper. Ow, and in our case, especially, right, as Axton, uh, basically what that relic would do would be, okay, what do we have? 20, 50, uh, 80, uh, 100. It would take us from like 100% gun damage you to like 120% gun pain. damage. That must mean I'm human! Yeah. You, yeah, Shadow would be good. The problem is Shadow, um, you know, is so small at this level. Yeah. Wow. Nice body block, bro. Dude. Fucking goalie. On the other one, dude? Yeah, that's when I alt tab to that other scene. No, I, I'm not that hearing the music right human. now. It's it's only on I'm the human, desktop I'm scene. Yay! This is the best day of my life. Mm -hmm. breath of a lot because you were chain downing. <laughs> That's great. Pain. I felt pain. 
That must be You know who'd love Breath of the Seraphs? Wilhelm? Actually deliberately do a fight for your life build with um, emergency protocols and chaining breath. You go back and forth between fight for your life and you're, you know, strong in both. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That... It's a fine day, full of opportunity. <laughs> Called Alt Red. So all the typing's jumbled. I have water jumping. Yeah, cool. Does it change the move pools or. Ow! That hurt! Wait! Humans feel pain! I felt pain! That's my. <laughs> you got the TVHM Warfare Maker at level 38. Neat, dude. Playing Sal or someone else? Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. ones look like just wouldn't be the I'm same human, I'm human. Yay! this is the best day of my life we are going to be using these in UVHM you know they're so very very strong and at the same time they're also a nice Hi. Whoops. I'm a robot, and I don't like Ah, oh, crap. Look what we did. Maybe? Look what I did. Sorry, you guys didn't do that. I did that. Anyway, and they are, like, also, like, a nice range. They're flexible. You don't have to be point blank. Uh, you can, you know, play in a more one-life manner with them. Even though they don't have moxie. So I was planning on mooning them for at least the beginning of UVHM. But, um, yeah, this is a really involved farm to get element with foregrip. I don't care about grip. Just foregrip and element. But that's, that doesn't make it easier. Hey, y'all, welcome to new and improved Catch a Rat! Now this guy trying to blame us? I mean, look, okay. Mostly it was my fault. Part of it was you, Glurdo. But I'm willing to take responsibility. His name as well. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. Damn. Detail. I didn't tell you not to do that, so you have no way of knowing. Right, right. Every time I turned it in, no less. Hey, Biznip. Go back to the... And redo the last two hours of stream now. Okay. Be careful what you wish for, though, because, like, probably 45 minutes of it was mal farming. I'll do it. You know what? No. Too bad. I'm doing it. I just need to unlock the farm again, because I fucked up. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I guess I did actually kind of technically get rid of my, um... Uh... And a shotgun, didn't I? Where were you when you almost died? Oh yeah, were you here or not here? For, uh... 
farming knowledge in... Oh my god, what the hell is it called? Hollowed Hollow. There we go. Dude, Hollowed Hollow is so fucking scary. Doing all of the checks in a one life, it's like 90% near death with lava. And we're learning. We got, you know, uh, useful information about it. But bro... You should have seen my save when um, unexpected geometry put me on a cliff. Had to nade jump out of that cliff. I had one chance. Hey, mutant, how's it going? Happy I could make it for the first to the first hour of stream. Yeah, something like that. First, third, you know. But how Clark? Nothing. Fortunately, there is nothing in uh, TK's. We don't have to go back there. On this seat, anyway. Anyway, that was the last two hours for me. I don't want to kill you, which is kind of weird. I need your help. Oh, I should have a name. Humans have names. Oh, do you really... Do I really have to do the second one, too? I shouldn't have save quit. I should have area transition, but whatever. No. No, this is just as well. No car station at Mel. For some reason. Hey, you know, I'll take your gun as a nice stopgap. You've got the Thompson. And there it goes. Oh no! <laughs> oh right. Funny how those end up having the same damage. Yeah, whatever. Jacob stock, technically okay on Hyperion. Good on Hyperion. Butcher and swap with the weapon on the ground. Oh yeah, sure. No, you're right. You're right. That would have saved me some time. But hey, now at least we're nice and clean anyway. Smart though. What's up, Stabler? How's it going, man? What was Donkey Mon? Because there he is. Donkey. Stink pot. Also fun. Also possibly very good for this farm. Oh god damn it. Okay, maybe this was a bad idea. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're actually kind of scary. Oh, good, we got one. And now we need to find a place for it. Go away, world burn. Oh, wait. I can't. Yeah, they're 49. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still, I still recognize how smart of an idea that was. Can't you weapon swap? No. Swapping weapons in one life is not allowed.
I don't understand the question. Wait, why did I go here? Oh yeah, human, we did it, we did it. Right, okay, so save quitting does work. If you have previously completed the whole mission chain, but you break it by picking up an earlier mission, like say the first mission, you can just complete that one mission again, and then save quit to get all of the subsequent missions back. Okay, that's actually really good to know. Please tell me I already Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, 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 good. We're good. Give me the stink pot. Oh, and, um, corrosive bone. Almost. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I feel. Mewen, what did you mean by can't you weapon swap? <laughs> nice. This guy's got a hell of a gun this time. Yeah, you just use that on my turret. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. <laughs> Hold the gun and swap it with the one on the ground. Were you asking if that was against one life rules? Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. Yes. Okay. Well, easy answer. No. You had no space. No, I understand the context, but I don't understand why you would wonder if that was against one life rules. Trying to figure out if there's something Ow, about hurt. doing that that would Wait, make me a bad person. Pain. I felt pain. Why are you hurting Mal so much? He likes it! Literally, he says uh, he gets so happy when he feels pain. Listen. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. I felt pain. That must mean I'm human! I'm human! I'm human! Yay! This is the- By the way, that fight was very fun! I don't know, man. Sometimes people make odd rolls. No, I don't think that's true. No, um... I think that the one life rules are actually very, very good. Exclamation point one life, if you would like to read them. Ow. And no, you'll, you'll notice there's nothing in there about... Dropping an item that you're holding that in favor of another I'm item. <laughs> Number one, sorry. Branding. There you go. Thanks, Bob. Ow! That hurt! Wait, humans feel pain. Oh! <laughs> And um, I would say that of all of the elements, that's the most important one, too. Oh. Life is good. Okay. Um, yeah, alright, I'm satisfied. Uh, we can use shitty fire one, good medi midland non-elemental one, better, good, good, mid good but not incredible non-elemental one, and then that. Okay, very happy. Very happy. Very happy. Now, um, what do we want to complete? Uh, just to get to 49 before Sawtooth so that we can use those for Sawtooth. Um, I would like to do something productive, you know, farming knowledge or whatever. Geary, well, sorry, I guess I should say before Geary because I do actually want to use those for Geary as well. Although... Now, Geary wouldn't even be XP, so we might as well do this first. We'll be geared for Geary. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm thinking like, you know, we do kind of a low impact piece of content, maybe Snowman DLC, just to check it off the list. Uh, Snowman DLC, you know, being, um, uh, the, like, absolute most One Life Safe DLC. You know, it's a joke. Snowman himself? Oh, no, we're Axton. We can kill Snowman in complete safety. How many checks in Snowman? Like, three, including the mission? Hmm. I think I want to do Wedding Day. Wedding Day is not exactly unsafe, except the final fight. It's a little more XP than I had in mind. Man, I'm really looking forward to all these dudes scrolling past this. It's like, oh, that's going to be so much fun to check. That's going to be fun to check. Um... Yeah, okay. If we were to do Wedding Day, it again, all, anything that we do now would be the, with the gear that we currently have. And the gear that we have is... Okay, it's just, it's not, you know, face rolly or anything. Hmm. Kind of want to do wedding day. We could do some quick checks at the very beginning, even. Um, what's our setup for... The Godliaths or the Goliath couple? Actually, wait, one other question. Do I know what my Godliath check is? Purple AR. We don't know which one. Doesn't matter. It's not something that we would farm. All right, let's do Wedding Day. Un but we will only do it until 49 and no later. We don't need to do the whole thing. We'll just do it until we have enough XP. And, um. Okay, wait, hold on. <laughs> final, final butcher sale. Uh, no. No, 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 no. Yes. Uh, sure. No. No. Okay. And uh, I guess, yeah, our... Okay, we don't need the stink pot anymore. Um, we'll be maining the Thompson. Don't have a good relic for that. Well, I guess I have the hard carry, and that's kind of cool. I mean, it's baby damage. Maybe I just want cooldown. Yeah, I'm sure. Whatever. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Dude, that was a hard decision to make. There's so much to choose from right now. Like, like, uh, just so much stuff. So many things. You know, all of the one life routing we've ever done. Totally up on its head. Hey there, Vault Hunter. Hey there, Moxie. It's good to be here. How sweet. Love is in the air. Something happened? Oh, that's, uh, that's probably not an omen or anything. Over here, sweetness. <laughs> Ellie and I have waged war on the Zafford and Hodunk bandit clans for years. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Can we go though? Over nine thousand. How's it going? Hey, remember to watch your digi peak with dirt and hugs. Oh, <laughs> oh man, that was years ago at this point. Good to have you, dude. How's your day going? 
Still working on that? Wait. Find Preacher. Moxie? You can hardlock this by save quitting after talking to Moxie. Everything going all right? No. Hey, remember, don't tell anyone I was a hodunk. Takes away a lot of my Checks denied. That's okay. We have a million options instead. And I'm happy to have learned that. Yes, Snowman DLC it is. Or... See the other headhunter? Uh... Craw? I think I want to do Craw. Run invalid. Good one. Hey, Info. How you doing, dude? You can fix it if you save quit again. All right, I'll try again. Sure. This time I won't even need boost there. I'll just kind of like, you know, take my time. Plod along. How about you too? Okay. All right, well, that gives me hope. Thanks. I'm even gonna just, like, walk down every stair. <gasps> oh! I am shit! Defying all expectations set by the first impression he makes with his name. Saving the day! Thanks, dude! Hey, Rockstar, how are you? No, I am shit, da man. We will ensure their pairing. Saving the wedding day. I know. I know the wedding was almost ruined. I need you to protect the bride and groom so this wedding goes off without a hitch. If we do this right, we'll end the clan war for good. Yeah, I am shit. More like I am the shit. Yeah. <laughs> Violence won't solve this L. We try I'm gonna teach you something? Oh, dude, no, the... You know, every day, right, we get to mark the calendar with what we learned about Borderlands that day. You think I'm exempt from that? Hell no. Those space pants. <laughs> hey, Mutant, thanks, dude. <laughs> thanks. thanks for doing something nice for I Am Shit 7. That's real wholesome. That was a real wholesome thing to do for I Am Shit 7. Thanks, man. I am shit. Enjoy the sub. Thanks to our mutant. Thanks, mutant. Leprechaun! Taking bets on the leprechaun farm. What's leprechaun gonna be? I bet leprechaun's gonna be a shield. No. It's gonna be a relic that's somehow helpful for Thompson or non-elemental butcher. Which is the fishing rod for... Where's the white fishing rod? Alright, whatever. If I can drop, I'm half in the bag and I can still run circles Shit, around you. Shit, he got away. Fucking turret. Not doing your job. Both your houses. Leprechaun out! <laughs> Oh, hey, Sigmund. Oh, we already... Okay. All right, a lot going on right now. Hold on, Sigmund. Oh, jeez. <laughs> um, yeah, you... Uh, where'd he go? Purple sniper rifle. Okay, you know what? No leprechaun. <laughs> no luck of the Irish today. Um, hang on. This should be... This... Rolling thunder! Oh! Delightful! Alright, moving on. That was a lot of excitement for 15 seconds. Hmm. 
That's what she said to me. Really? The 15 seconds had a lot of excitement. Suggesting we throw a stolen baby into a potion. What? No, we ain't gonna hurt him. Just kidnap him. You know, a lot of people say, like, Bloodshot Ramparts is their favorite track. But come on, look. Bloodshot Ramparts is good. It's not even as good as this one, though. Mm. You know, there might be some aged whiskey in the distillery, Vault Hunter. Head there now. Yay, fishing! Oops. Hey, what's up, Nana? <laughs> Alright, Ikora is unique shotgun. Oh. Still looking for a twister. Looks like the distillery shut up tighter than an abstinence advocate at an orgy. Must have caverns for, for the for the ambience. Ambience, ambience, music. Okay. Woe is me. Hey, Magnus, how's it going? Did we learn yesterday that unique shotgun doesn't narrow it down at all? <laughs> I know, I know. But it narrows it down more than no hint. That item now is more likely to be um, a twister. Let's go save her, man. Chicks dig heroes. Then you know, if uh, a check that we haven't checked yet. Whatever. Octo, yeah. Or right, any of the um, like six unique Jacob shotguns, like Magnus is alluding to. Where's my music? Oh, dude, Magnus Lighthouse, agree. Magnus Lighthouse might be my actual favorite, but I don't know, man. You know I'm bad at favorites in general. I also really like Three Horns Divide combat. Oh, hi, buddy. Uh oh. favorite chatter why is it i am shit seven nah i mean it's like as much as as much as like you know i am shit seven is like one of my favorites it's like it's so hard to pick favorites there's like i am shit seven there's butt spot there's brandy for personal reasons it's max level lee and tvhm um He's based on entering Three Horns Divide for the first time after killing Flint. 
uh, maximum level 38, so probably that. Why, what's your lead drop? Marlene. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Marlene's not really my favorite chatter. What the heck is that? Bobby Mac Gun. Okay, that's what it says on the tin. I see that, yes. That's a lot of whiskey. You've got to find the high quality old stuff. Actually, isn't like on most people's chats it firing in the wrong direction? <laughs> on my screen it is towards me. Yeah, I do have my chat to the left of my video preview. That didn't sound good. Let's try another. It's just an orc level to Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, all you, all you care about is that. sucks. <clears throat> I hate whiskey. <laughs> Axton. You still see straight. You haven't found the good stuff. Keep sipping. I can't feel my face. Probably a good thing. Mm, that's the stuff. Grab some of that whiskey and we'll get to the next ingredient. No longer just holding it. Yeah, right, right, right. Oh, find something. Yeah. <laughs> We've got new, old, and borrowed. You'll need to find some gold. There's gotta be some around here. The Zaffords are as greedy as they come. Huh. Dead end. You'll have to find a way through. Allow me, Vault Hunter. It's the least I can do to repay you. Oh. There. Your nearest stash of gold coins. Grab a few and we'll have everything we need for the first time. The Zaffords are real Oh, I'm drunk. I got over it. A fantastic day for capitalism. Uh, blue one is right there, right? Hey, buddy. I see the sacred man grease. Yeah, or, you know, whatever kind of grease, whatever kind of miscellaneous grease location. Check Torg DLC. No, not yet. No, we've gotten to the level that we are. Um, just doing main game checks. Uh, and a couple headhunters. Now including this one. I don't like your gun. Think it is? Oh, hey! Get away from me! Is it? Hey, Gl uh, <laughs> Kale, good to see you. Welcome home. It is! Oh! That's a get. Let's see, which of our skyrockets um, should we use? Hmm. Uh, let, me, let me compare. 
Let's see, this one has 1100 blast radius and 1 1.6 fuse time. Um, the one that I picked up first has uh, 1100 radius and 1 1.6 fuse time. Alright, this one's level 1, I think, and this one's level 1. Shit, this is tough. Alright, I think I'll take this one. First, add the gold. Looking good. Now, the whiskey for something old. Now toss in the baby! <laughs> toss in the baby! Are you kidding? Don't toss the baby. Just hold it over the mixer and make it cry. Sometimes you'll try to make people laugh by using a meme from the Echo Net, but instead they'll track you down and set fire to your house. Look forward to that. Dude. The baby's Seriously? True. This right here? This Rip is my not last house. good guys do. Yellow! Never say that again. Sounds like the love potion's mixing as we speak. Hey, with all this talk of marriage, I'm curious. Was there ever a Mr. or Mrs. Vault Hunter in your life? Dated a bunch of people, but only got married the one time. Wonder how she's doing. That's looking lovely. Now, just turn on the machinery to distill it. Take the one that doesn't actually like kill you. I guess that depends on your skill. Yeah, do you mean like take the me that doesn't actually Better accidentally kill me? Easier said than done. Okay, baby. now toss in the baby. <laughs> I already forgot I put it on. I threw that like a fastball. Okay. We're not going to main that. We're going to use it to, you know, get through uh, situations that warrant it. If we're just using our grenade for healing, like we are right now with this build, let's stick to the fastball. Since I have, you know, 48 levels of muscle memory for that. It's like five seconds. I know. I know. Rarest relic. What green relic? I know, right? Really? Okay, thanks. Ooh. All right, that's inconvenient. Uh, but actually, this is where I am going to use the skyrocket. Why does my turret keep not... Yeah, let's turret. Wow, nice reach! <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> We found our second Hyperion pistol check. Alrighty. Alright. Uh, we got another one. It's Bizneps Rough Rider Farm. Yeah, no, I've, I've seen that. Oh, you're the fire one. Uh oh.
legendary rocket launcher. You don't say. Hey, what's our bada boom source again? Oh, I thought we did. No, I guess that's in the seed with Biznap. Oh, Lord. He's purple, right? Fire Kraken is the purple fish. Or Norfleet, true, but I'd prefer Bottaboom, but... Or Norfleet! That'd be a pretty fair Norfleet farm. Um... Yeah, how do you repeat the purple fish outside of the story? You have to kill Blingloader, but, um, you know, testing Blingloader, uh, Blingloader doesn't respawn, so I think the purple fish just shows up in the potion room somewhere, like in a bucket or something. Obviously, um, Bling Loader respawns if you redo the mission, but, uh, only if you redo the mission. Wait, it's just in a bucket where Bling Loader runs to. Okay, yeah, 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 the potion something room. Something new, okay. something old, something borrowed, and something gold. I'm pretty sure that's it. You sure? Ain't it something blue? What? Blue doesn't rhyme with gold. <laughs> Thank you. We've moved the wedding into the fresh air. Just put the potion in the punch bowl and we'll get started. All right. Yeah, I kind of want to use that, but... Yeah, let's, let's mess with it. Actually, you know what we should really do in that fight is skyrocket. That was a really nice get. The bride and groom quiver with anticipation. Um, dearly beloved, we are gathered here to screw all of you. We're gathered here to screw all of you. Oh, that's hot. Especially that traitorous dumbass bag of boobs, Moxie. Son of a. No, we're here for peace. Just put the potion into the ceremonial punch bowl. I ain't gonna drink that! Of course you wouldn't, you coward! The hell I am! Oh my god, I already forgot. Do we know our god Lyoth check? Purple AR, right, okay, yeah. Ha! Who's yelling now? I ain't letting no whole dumb princess out drink me! Hell no! Is he using a little bucket as a mug? Say, hey, you look pretty good all of a sudden. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm all flustered. <laughs> oh, we can't kiss with these helmets on. Yeah, let's take them all. Love ain't no fun with protection. <laughs> <laughs> Uh oh. Oh shit, I fucked up. Get them both. There we go. <laughs> Just need them to be next to each other. You know, that was actually strats. Okay. Legendary grenade from Bridget. Purple relic from Colin. And I kind of shot our whole let's start acting like good guys plan of the foot. Told you the recipe. I would like to learn about legendary grenade. Yes. And, you know, I'm happy to get to learn about purple relic while we're at it. Yeah. Oh, hey, I guess we did sort of unite the clans, even if it's just so they can kill us. I, uh, I'll call that a win. Never really seeing purple relic 15 times. Yeah, which is okay. Um... I think that, like, the ratio of getting relics, including purple relics, of which there are a lot of good ones out there, uh, to getting, you know, like, guns and class mods and, um, grenades and stuff is pretty good. 
trying really ah, hard hey. <laughs> now we can farm the uh, 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 antagonist faster, but also more dangerously. Hmm. So, uh, innuendo bot needs something. Uh, I don't think we need another one of those. That's nice. Um, let's do learning to love. And let's do final, uh, pressure. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I, I think I'd prefer the storm as a way of being able to farm Jim Kepler faster, but that's okay. Well, we can do it with the Tunguska. That was a rocket speed Tunguska, which does make it safer. For this particular far oh gotcha I see right <laughs> I love pressure why is she like this why is she like this Are you kidding? Wow, she's tough. Like, she's tanky. True final boss. E tech Relic. Okay, that's cool. Although we already have the one that we really care about, which is Bone. So yeah, we don't need to do that. Um, but that is very cool. Rarest category, by the way, tied for like unique launcher. Uh, there are like the fewest E-Tech Relic items. All right, hold on, SMG only Axton. Three Tunguskas. Right, very long mission. True. Like this, a guy misses the high quality stogies from the central planets. My old self would have been a phallic innuendo from the central cigar, planets, as in, like, or, or similar to a uh, Central America. You may find one in the Saber Distillery. Confession when I look at Moxie, I feel a sharp pain in my hypothetical stomach. Though she is my mother, I feel an intense love for her. Is this normal? Ah. That's weird as hell. <laughs> Stella! Need your wig. Mind if I borrow it? Oh, I'm sorry, but this wig is wired into my friend or foe subroutine. If I were to remove it, I'd go insane and probably die. Uh, Same thing would happen to me without my hair. I'm on a quest, and it calls for that wig. But it's just a side quest, right? You could just, like, not finish it. It's not worth ha, 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 killing my girlfriend and I, is it? Yeah. No, I but mean, the checks so are. Oh, it's so worth killing your girlfriend and you. Sorry, but I hate leaving quests unfit. Hey, hold on. Hold on again. Really 
All right, Stella, unique AR. Ed, purple grenade. Well, I like unique AR. He said the thing. Yeah, that's right. He said the name of the stream. You know, I really should have saved quit before going through this so I could get the purple fish again. But that's okay. They may have scrambled his AI. Could be Mrov. Yeah, but this Mrov is too parts specific for this particular source. I wouldn't farm it if we did. Mood point. Oh, I do say man grease. Oh. Oh, I guess we do know that it's very specifically man grease. Okay. This grease will come in handy. The what? The sacred man's grease? I'll check for the purple fish here, but I doubt it's there. Until safe quit. It's just like here or something. This setup doesn't seem as nice. Oh, jeez. Okay, actually, yeah. Okay, well, we have ads now, so that's better. Hey, Dreams, how's it going, dude? Man, they're hard on the repeat. Like, notably, this is different. Okay, Bridget almost done. Let me, let me switch to a consistent slag. Oh, right, four Tunguskas. Good. <laughs> Do we have enough skyrockets for this? <laughs> Oi. Okay, Colin, I need you to go that way now. Do your manly, husbandly duties or whatever. Got him. Cool. Yeah, that's sketch. This whole thing is sketch. But we got nothing. Fuck. Fire Butcher might help. Although, actually, we didn't get a particularly good Fire Butcher. Really wish that I could have seen the legendary relic in particular. Oh, sorry, legendary grenade in particular. Mm -hmm. 
You butcher. You brought her here. No, Colin brought her here. Uh, but I'll butcher anyway. If Colin's okay with that. Wow! Look at how good that is at killing me. <laughs> yeah, that one is the most rocket speed, so I would do that, if anything, if we're going to use the Tunguskud farm antagonist. Which I'm still on the fence about. Business is pleasure. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. What was the white fish fresher? Um Hyperion pistol? Or is what what order is this? Okay, no, Sigmund is first. Rolling Thunder. Yeah, these are in color order, because I logged them that way. So Sigmund, Rolling Thunder, Ikora, Unique Shotgun. So let's do green every time. Orange we didn't care about, so I'm not even gonna bother spawning her. Rue, she's ridiculous. All right, hold on. Let me see if I can trap him this time. Got him. Nothing. <laughs> God damn it, me. <laughs> <laughs> Biznap's neurons start firing at all of the hints. Oh, uh, wait, no, green is y'all. Yeah. I hate swapping weapons so much. They're also useful. Though. Okay, this one's green. This is the orange one that we don't care about. Whole lot of nothing. Hey, what's up, Evie? How you doing? That's really cool though. I am very happy to have this knowledge. Now, farming that one for casual uh, would be a little rough. It's one in seven, right? So like, doubtful. But I'm sure we will at some point in this character before they die. Let's go get purple again. Here without a nade jump. Oh, you see? Or not? Huh, that's a weird collision. Fuck. Uh, mm -hmm. not again. 
Okay, I like this. Now we're gonna use that. Okay. How parts locked is the compensator? Overcompensator. Um, fixed accessory. I think that's it. Wait, can you really not? I'm impressed. Fine. All right. Screw it. Oh, you can just go that way? It's still busted open? Fine. <laughs> I think it's just accessory. They were compensated. Grip? Really? Oh, grip stock and element are variable. Oh. <laughs> nice. Hey, Gage! Gage, is this it? Is this you? Finishing your stream? After having gotten a win? Well, another win. Okay, is this it again? He did it. Oh. Oh. Hey Invictus, good to have you. This is me finishing my stream after dying! <gasps> Again? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh dude, what was it? Hey everybody, good to have you on this side. I'm doing meme one life. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, but like, like you get the you get the joke. You get the joke. <laughs> Chain lightning didn't think explosive spiders were that damn aggressive. Oh, huh. Below health gate, spider took you and itself with it. It was that it was the only it. Jumped after you like eight times. Huh. Kind of good for him. Yeah. Wow. Uh, which one's per, per? You. We get to farm the Fire Thresher, because it has, um, Legendary Rocket Launcher, and I would like to know what that is. So, you, you're about to witness back-to-back -back one life losses. Oh. Also, I think I, um... Did that too soon. Hold on. Was nothing stupid like walking off the edge of the jump puzzle. I mean, okay, look. Um, you're right, that sounds stupid, okay? But, like, um, if you die to that, it's because you're so good at the video game that you were going so fast for the jump puzzle to even be ready for you, okay? And that's not so bad. I think that's fair. Oh my god, dude, this guy! Uh, did I not even heal from that? Okay. I hate you. You are awful. Also, kind of want to take a knee to you, because it's just me and you. No, we're good. Nope. Yeah, maybe we should hold off until 49 to use our Butcher for him. Don't need to do this one. We can finish learning to love. Hit your OP-10 Sal death. Oh, that's a pretty good one. Oh, I can't believe that you didn't make fun of me for that one. That, like, out of all of your options, you chose the, uh... Um, no. Uh, jump puzzle one and not the OP-10 Sal at the very beginning of his completion playthrough. Anyone have the clip for that by any chance? On those space pants. Hey, thanks, your Kale. Butt is Good space. looking. Your butt is from thanks space. for getting a raptor. Even if it's raptor. It's real good of you, man. Raptor, enjoy. Thanks to, thanks to our friend here. I'm good. Understood. We must now attempt the nuclear option. Bring the last valentine to Moxie. That I may pour out my heart and Even let raptor sub himself? Raptor doesn't get an allowance. Talking about the grenade jump farming rom No, that wasn't an OP10 character. That was like OP6 or something. Uh, OP8. That was a good one too, though. Yeah. 
Yeah. Not exempt from the conversation. Vault Hunter, go kill innuendo bot. But why? I thought love was like a shield bar to be whittled down by the bullets of persistence. No, Are that's those space stopping. pants? Because your butt is space. Your butt is space. Hey, from thanks space. whoever did that. Emphasis on, um, whoever. Thanks for the, um, Maybe leave him alone. act of like blind generosity. <laughs> that was real good of you, whoever you are, just, you know, making sure that our friend Corn gets taken care of, too. Never mind. Waste him. <laughs> enough about me, how are you? I don't think it's enough about you. Oh, he's not AI. There we go. Oh good, he has crits. Unlike the other bot we farmed. Well, that's that. I'll chunk his AI core and reprogram it from scratch. Come on back, Vault Hunter. Um, I see doll body. So that's just the retainer. <laughs> I don't don't think we're gonna be using that. Okay, good intel. Is anyone bot innuendo bot saying repeat my name, a breaking bad reference? I think it's supposed to be sex, you know. Like, oh yeah. Say my name. That's the last time okay. I can watch romantic. Not for us, comedies. but cool. Hey, what's up, Will? How you doing? People say yeah, exactly. Yeah, gauge gauge fucks. Gauge knows. Um, alright, what did we what checks did we get from learning to love? Uh, Ed is Purple Grenade, Stella's Unique AR. And honestly, that mission's kinda low impact. I wouldn't mind doing it again. I've got a plan. Uh, learning to love. I do, in fact, not fucks. I mean, <laughs> why are you why are you holding out on the world like that? The world wants you to fucks. Is this the OP-10 cell rip? Is it, um, unassuming docs? If so, yes. No. Uh... No, not- this is not the one that we're talking about. Yeah, I kind of don't want to do these guys again until we have something more to work with for them than just the Skyrocket. Oh, these are so tantalizing. Like, come on, man. We're, um, we're just a bar and a half away. Let me put you on. Who tries to put on cell? I don't know. Uh... Just getting into one life. Yeah, no, I know. I, I don't know. We've got, uh, like, a couple to OP-10. Uh, a few to OP levels. I don't have a count. Of, like, how many tries total. But that was... That was when I got bored. Um, was grinding out the Sal win. That was when I stopped doing one life. On something less wasteful. Hey. Oh, come on. Thanks, antagonist. Oh my god, did you actually find it? Yep, yeah, I think this is the one. And I like the Twitch player just not working, that's fun. Good job, Twitch. You're a video website. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Let's try Firefox. Better. So, context. I had 
just finished gearing up for the OP10 playthrough. We went through Liarsburg to unlock the, um, you know, main game fast travel. And, oh yeah, same shirt. Hey, would you look at that? And so we're going to get the Grog. Everyone knows what's going to happen. <laughs> Not even Ragdoll. <laughs> if I had just been aiming like two degrees to the left, you know, it would have gone like every other time that we ran through that uh, path. No. No, I had to be looking two more degrees to the right than usual. Yeah, still in Boston. Uh, yeah, no, any... Anytime you see green screen, it's um, Boston, not Cali. I've always used a... Uh, full camera since I lived here. <laughs> Hello, Mayor Levin. Good to see you. How you doing? Full camera is the way. Fuck that setup for green screen. Yeah, it's just I couldn't do uh, full camera in that spot because um, I didn't have a background. Like, I worked out of a storage room when I lived in that old place. It was, like, literally just boxes and stuff behind me. Um, now that I have a, you know, actual living room. It's a lot nicer. Speaking of, I'm not colorful enough. I'm gonna play this for a few days, but hopefully tonight. Oh, have you been thinking about it? This shit worked out to be so good. The number of people that I've been getting saying that, oh, I get to play like an hour before work, or finally I'm off work, I get to play, you know, a couple hours for once, or, uh, hey, I haven't played Borderlands 2 in three years, but um, I, this mod has made me again. Or, I've never modded BL2, uh, but I was willing to try for this mod. Stop. You're gonna try Lurando right now? That sounds like a good, just, like, take a breath before you do <laughs> zero again. I know you're gonna, like, go right back into zero and get the win, like, next run, but, like... Good, give yourself a little bit of purple ward first. Yeah. All right, well, at least we learned his. It's regular bandit nade. Dude, I really wish that these were good at slagging. Like, regular nades, you can get in longbow, zero fuse, 900 radius. 900, like, the size of the map. And they're, like, single-stage delivery. They're, like, actually instant, unlike Betty's or the magic missile or transfusions, right? All of those kind of take a second. Um, these things, if these actually had good status effect chance, they would be the slag nade. You would throw one, and the whole map would be slagged. Or throw two, to get the rest of the map slagged. Yeah. Ow. Nice gun. Shoot it at that instead. Thank you. Yeah, good job, turret. I'm gonna pause for purple bandit grenade. <laughs> um, hey, don't, don't write off purple bandit nades. At least the Mervs. Oh my god, the Mervs are fucking insane. Fastball without being a fastball. 
It's just, uh, you know, good luck farming them in vanilla. Or in loot rando if you don't get, like, even a particularly fast source for them. Like face McShooty or whatever. Not back in one life for a few months. I, I, you say that. I don't necessarily believe you. I didn't get the grease. I got the fish. Did, right? I did get the fish, but I didn't get the grease. Hey, Stacy. Good to see you. How are you? Wait, what was the blue fish? Forgot to grease the fish? <laughs> uh, fire Kraken. Oh no, Moby is blue fish. He was Hyperion Pistol. Okay. Ikora was the other interesting one. So we care about green and purple. That's all. Yeah. This green will come in. <laughs> Freaking antagonist getting me passive kill skills. Personally, shoutouts to not doing solo one life anymore. I am in the mood for love. Get a um, to some I like how you had to specify personally because you're still Lila, willing to do one life so long as it's with me. Also, same, by the way. I will neg the first subject. Prepare yourself for a compliment forward slash insult the world has never seen. You know what? Let's do it. Fuck me. God, how big is that radius? Okay, so we should just like start the fight a million miles away. Oh, the stagger. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh! Oh! information we got the drop the info drop all right cool don't have to do fire kraken ever again bless oh krishna that's the thing is like every single drop source has loot even if you are playing with duds and actually from now on i'm gonna i've decided i'm going to play with duds um even if you're playing with duds, uh, when you get a dud, it feels like dopamine because, you know, it genuinely is, like, valuable. Everything is valuable. Learning that you don't need to do a source again because they don't drop anything that you need or don't drop anything, period, is still exciting. It still feels good because it's, like, finality, you know? You got what you wanted and it was discovering something. Was launcher bunny. <laughs> I still want to figure out Ed, what Ed's unique AR is, because you know, it could be hail, it could be kitten, but especially it could be hail. Note system is so cool and would be great if it was implemented in more mods going forward. <laughs> um. Moxie, 
Yeah, I, uh, I kind of had that um, idea on the back burner of, like, automatic tracking. Thinking that it wasn't, like, you know, thinking it would be a big deal to implement. Um, uh, and wasn't that important because, you know, people were having fun, like, writing down their own thing. Turns out it's fun writing down your own stuff for, like, 20 minutes. And then it's like, you know, there's 480 checks you need to write down for every seed. And that's a lot. Fortunately, I had made the mod in such a way all along where I was able to have information about when a player actually got a drop or not. So I sat down and I made the tracking feature in a few hours and it wasn't that bad and it was so worth it. Got annoying after the third play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, I, I'm, I'm just especially happy that it was actually kind of possible to, um, to do. Chunk his AI core and reprogram it from scratch. Come on back, Vault Hunter. Hey, Papa. How you doing? Hail, <laughs> kitten, Scorpio. Turret as a gun. <laughs> hey, Kander. How you doing? How work? That's the last time I let him watch romance. Well, yeah, we still need a little bit of XP. So I'll do it one more time, one more chance at Ed to hit 49. And I guess while we're at it, one more chance at Sword Explosion. Uh, casual Sword Explosion. One day your Krieg will find hail. I I long for that day for you too. I think Cowboy's the least considered. Yeah, right. Or the Stomper. No, I think the Stomper is more forgotten about than the Cowboy, because the Cowboy has like notoriety, you know? Like people know about the Cowboy because they know about the blue Hammerlock DLC ARs and how bad they are. The Stomper, though, everyone, no one thinks about the Stomper, because it's, like, completely unnotable, not bad, not good. And it's from this mission that no one ever does. Uh, you know, the, um, what a nice day. No, the, the Stomper? It's, um, a blue Jacob's AR. Always Jacob's Barrel. I don't even know what's unique about it. Maybe, like, slightly higher crit bonus. Um, you get it for doing the Hungry Like the Skag mission. You know, the one where, like, you kill Skags and they drop a gun. And there's, or an echo recording of a guy saying, What a nice day. And then you collect gun parts and turn them into Marcus. Sure, it's a hundred percent bonus crit. Well, shit, that's not bad. Really? It's like not bad at all. <laughs> Better voice acting than Jax. No, no Jax is good. Like really good. But yeah, it's up there. <laughs> hey, Jerry, how's it going? Right, so that's the thing, it's like, people know about the cowboy, you know, again, not in a positive way necessarily, but... Also... That last point in Metal Storm will go very nicely with this. 
Uh, actually, better yet, this. Oh, hey, What's up? 50%. Okay, yeah. Which is fine. <laughs> Excuse me. Stella! Need your wig. Mind if I borrow it? Oh, I'm sorry, but this wig is wired into my friend or foe subroutine. If I were to remove it... It's 50% type A, right? In combination with Jacob's AR is 20% type B. Uh, so, like, the card says, like, 72% or something. Hey! Okay! It's Scorpio. Now we know. Information! Alright, uh, let's go do the couple. Those are the... Oh, those space legendary grenade is the last thing that we want to learn about. Your legendary grenade from, from Colin or whatever. Hey, thanks, Kale. Again, thanks for getting another friend. Real good of you to take care of Kamarov. Hey, Kamarov! One of us. One of us. Enjoy the sub from Kale, dude. I sure hope Skags don't kill me and break my gun into four different parts. And then he says, Oh, God! In, in just the most... Emotional, breathy way. Like, give that guy an Oscar. For, just for the... Oh, God! You get Scorpio. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah. That's right, reward the gambling. Yeah, that's not significantly better either. Okie dokie. <gasps> well. Come on, Colin. Thank you. Ah, shit. Well, at least now they're together. Alright, let's do strats for Whittle. Oh no, he died. Ah, god damn it! No! Oh my god, are we gonna die? Yeah, today I learned you need a really face rolly setup for this fight. Okay, there are more ads over here. Let's collect some grenades while we have a moment of reprieve with the turret. Oh my god. Oh, right, that. Oh, thank you, turret. Going down again. Actually, can we just kind of like leave? Can we at least buy more nades? Oh, maybe. Uh oh. <laughs> no, but we can regen some. And, um, you know. Oh, God! Jerk ass! Yeah, you know, this might be it. We might have learned something about new content. Again.
Let me think. What do we have? Okay. Let's try whittling strat again, and this time hopefully Colin doesn't... We don't whittle Colin so low that he dies to a dot again. Let's make use of the ammo that we have, though! really ain't looking good. Oh. Hello. Excuse me. Thanks. Okay. Okay, closer. Got some turret for a second. That's nice. Good. Please. Oh, shit. Wait, she died too? Well, seething couple. I love that it just keeps getting worse. Hey, at least we got some grenades now. <sighs> Fuck! <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, that's all of that. <sighs> I just want to try to Tunguska with enough orc stacks. The fact that they don't stand still is very difficult. The fact that, you know, if you accidentally kill them at the wrong time, which is easier than it should be, I found. Very difficult. Can I get some more? Thank you. Uh, not uh, opportune time, I guess, though. good time to have orc. Where is she? we have fresh fight for life because that had been a while but yeah definitely just keep working on Bridget kill her next Tector's in the zone that we want him to be 
Easier said than done, though. She's got a shitload of health. Okay. So they're both low. If I could do... Wow! Um, Orch Tunguska right now, with both of them here. Easier said than done. That would be wonderful. Oh, I'm out of nades. <laughs> nope, come on. Fuck it. Oh! <laughs> we did it! I can't believe we actually got out of that. <laughs> and we didn't even get the drop. <laughs> oh, hey, Sonka. How's it going? <laughs> um, hey, to be fair, how are you? Yeah, that was really hard. Yeah, okay. If we're ever going to do couple again, we need to have rock solid setup um like yeah we can do that with just the sky rocket or the guns that we have but we need to execute perfectly you know it's uh it can't the fight can't get to that point where a they've leveled up three times and b we're out of ammo on the things that uh we were depending on <laughs> in along the process <sighs> Oh, but man, dude, dude, this is exactly, again, I keep saying this, this is exactly what I wanted out of Loot Rando One Life, is having to do shit like that. <laughs> like, that was more excitement than I got out of um, One Life in, like, any of the OP-10 runs that we did. <laughs> that was, that was, like, you know... Uh, you know, having to, like, play as perfectly as I like, was able and, and, you know, improvise and, like, you know, figure out new shit, like, you know, and the spur of the moment and... <sighs> okay. Primax in gameplay, I don't know. Although, yeah, dude, using the Tunguska, like, you know, actually, uh... Getting some kind of, like, you know, um, productive use out of the Tunguska? When do you ever do that? <laughs> okay, what time is it? Um, I've earned snack and coffee. I'll be right back, and then we're gonna beat the main game with our level 49 butchers, as was the plan. Give me one second, hold on. <laughs>
recommend Wild Bailey and Yogurt and Granola. Okay, I mean, I think that's actually a pretty meal. But not when you have in mind. Okay. Hello. Uh, thank you for your patience. Um, I made myself something very nourishing. I have um, yogurt with strawberries and granola in it. And um, then for dessert, I get to eat another piece of fruit. <laughs> look at his groggy eyes. Look at look at the camera. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's so sleepy. <laughs> now, Gary. Oh, yeah, that's true. <gasps> oh, that's a great idea. What a good piece of content to do while we eat granola. Beal 2 Lou Rando, any percent seat? Yeah, seated, definitely. I agree. Oh, heck yeah, Geary. Man, I haven't done Geary in years. What about you guys? Mm. And you know what else? The whole time we get the objective collect can of grease. When you win, that'll make you a first in a brand new one life category. Yeah, totally. <laughs> um, yeah, I think, um, you know, we're there to be everyone running one life with the same seed. That, that would be something. Let's knuckle dragger. Seraph weapon. Oh yeah, Tatler. A simple stroll to Iridium Flight. How wonderful. I'm genuinely looking forward to this. It's gonna be relaxing. It's different. Like, when's the last time you guys walked through the dust, you know? Okay, you're one of the people that you see on the side of a busy street, jogging as all the cars drive by, right? Feeling overburdened by money. Thanks for the scratch. Pleasure doing bit farewell, man. Hey, deity, how you doing? Yeah, obviously, any anything that you were to run in Loot Rando would be a meme. But that's why memes are fun. You know, clap clap ship, wasn't it Flint? No! Oh, you went all the way up there? Instead of, you know, right here?
You know, honestly, let's run Rifleman until we get to, like, Iridium Blight. Be a lot better if loot would drop. Been lucky enough. I'm already way out leveled for what I was trying to get. Still hunting because I'm not leaving until the loot drops. What are you going for? Are you trying to learn the contents of a hint or actual item that you're farming? Custom seed and seed list. Mopey for WAP! You want me to be your WAP? Oh, I hope we're thinking of the same WAP! Knuckle Dragger had a sham. Wonderful. Um. This way or this way? This way. Yeah, thanks to Kale again. I'm glad you got one camera up. I don't think we know our Lee yet, do we? No, we do. It's the striker. Awesome. a leisure fight what does that even mean a leisure fight what what is that fight against Savage Leaf. Oh, no, no. We don't need the striker. Fair question, though. You know, <clears throat> this actually is pretty easy in TVHM. Everything being so underleveled, including the dust, because, you know, TVHM dust. Just in case, though. Our priority is <clears throat> killing cars. Hey, Nerida, how are you doing?
How much slower is it to go through Ellie's? Eh, alright. We won't. There you go, Bunny Emote. That's your solution. <laughs> mod the mod. I support this. Butcher just is fun. One might say it's like the definition of fun, you know? Because it's like the definition of fun is fast. And the butcher is fast. Therefore, the butcher is the definition of fun. trust a car to not just immediately come out of that and run me over. You know, this actually doesn't take that long. Absolutely, in re reference to like the conversation earlier, this is not the longest mission in the game. Not even close. take that long. Is that what she said? I don't think she would use the word take. That's implying that she wants it to be short. And, well, if that's the situation, sucks for her, dude. Oh. Fuck. Me. When does this unlock? Yeah, we could do it, right? I guess that probably unlocks after Sawtooth. Oops. Yeah. Easy. I'm Not even a problem. Thanks, Kurt.
Okay, I actually don't want kill skills at random times, so I'm glad that my turret ran out there. Okay, we're at the end. Don't, don't fucking jump into lava now. The gearbox sniper! Oh my god, that's like so close to proper item progression. Gas Mask got, um, gearbox rifle from Knuckle Dragger, which is just as perfect as it can get. Hey, Philip, how's it going? That's amazing. I know. It was so perfect. Oh my god, we did it. <laughs> that wasn't even bad. Alright, buddy. Oh, okay. Okay, antagonist. <laughs> Should go cancel due to rain. Sports? Hmm. This is where you can all call it. What do we get? Um, or, you know, like my third time ever doing Geary's. Geary, no! No, it's okay. He took he took the one gear with him. Aggression relic, <laughs> unique pistol. Well, so it's not gonna be hints. We actually do get four copies of the item from it. Could be Gearbox SMG. Could be Depression. Could be Crit. Could be a shield. Bravo, Kale. Bet you didn't see this shield coming, did you? Um. Well. That's a lot of mass. Yeah, I know. So these, these are four black holes, like, orbiting each other. Um, creating electromagnetic disturbances. Eventually, they'll all um, uh, assimilate with one another, creating like rippling gravitational waves. But for now, we know that we don't need to do Geary's, and that's nice. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna exit safely, and then we can save quit. So sick at gambling. Oh, and I'm green bouncing, buddy. <laughs> we'll see four black holes open each other. Yeah, yeah, you've heard of, like, the three-body problem. What about the four-body problem? Oh, hey, Pavel. How you been? Just watch Jolt's YouTube video, part five of the Lou Randomizer mod. <laughs> Randomized bathrooms! Is it a men's room? Is it a women's room? Is it a family room? Is it an all genders room? What's what bathroom am I gonna walk into next? Can't play it because you're on PS4 and I don't have a PC. Okay, well, uh, someday, you know, next time you get a console, um, make that console a PC instead of a PS5 or whatever it is at the time. That's all. Something to look forward to. Not for you. Nether drops anything, only way to get gear is with the bathrooms. Yeah, toilets, yeah, right, like interactable toilets, yeah.
Can't wait to get the PC. That'll be a dream. Yeah, dude. Can't wait for you. Good. Don't need that yet. We'll just have that. Uh, make sure we're soldier. Fill up on ammo. Actually, how's our iridium? 89. All right, let's get more shotgun because of how Sawtooth is. Um. Also, while we're there, we'll pick up uh, Kai. Even though I can't remember if it gives anything or not. Hey, we did Ulysses, right? What did Ulysses give? Hold on, we'll check. Where do we put the 50 on that? Yeah, never mind. Forget the shotgun. That's pretty good. No, slot machine is not a check. I didn't think that that, um, even if I could justify it, that would be a good move to make it slot machines checks. Um, great escape. Kitten. Oh. Wait, but that's like really good though. Uh, and then a chosen one. Blue engineer, which we don't need in this seed. Anything else? Capture the flags. Anti-faction. We have the skyrocket. But man, anti-faction would uh, <laughs> do the married couple better, right? Uh, lost treasure we know wasn't good, but what was it? Impaler. Yeah, we got all the Molly One shields in this seed. <laughs> no, like actually, we've got Impaler, we've got Black Hole, and we've got um, uh, Antagonist. I'll get chosen. No, no, no. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We're not going that way. Alright, Sawtooth. Uh, first I'm gonna use the restroom. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> Sleep well, Glurdo. Thanks for the well wishes. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Infection kills grandma. Skyrocket doesn't. Okay, but Tunguska does. Right now, my grandma killing build is Tunguska, and I think that's better than infection. Anti infection. Oh, also, what was Mortar? Winter is over. We're fine. You gotta steal some Y94 Domo charges if you want to get into the info stockade and find the warrior. Take the elevator to get to where they store them. Hey, old Madison, how's it going? Aw, oh, look, everybody! It's a witty bitty slab trying to use our elevator! Get out of here! You can still run! Oh, hello. Good. That was good. Good. Hmm. Can I just 
get above health gate and stay there for a second. Thanks. Beautiful. Skyrocket and Ruby. Man, really deviating from the one life we're out here. The difference is how we earned the Skyrocket. It's pulling loaded. Imagine being a monster and killing grandma. That's even worse than puns. Is it? How many people were adversely affected by me killing grandma in Borderlands 2? Okay. Now, how many people actually suffered from your hu sense of humor? Uncountable. No barrels. Untrue, Evie's puns have never hurt anyone ever. I had to go to a doctor that one time Evie said that one thing. Something. Okay, definitely this is gonna do us more good than the launcher. I'm a monster like because one of those puns. Yeah! I want to hang around here to let all of the um, launcher enemies spawn. That's good. Twister from Gwen's head? Oh, you actually get to farm a usable Twister! First time using the Twister ever? I don't blame you, but oh, man. That's a good first time. I probably did not blow up, um... Yeah, I, I think I did forget to kill the buzzard. Oop. It's okay, because I also forgot to get killed, too, so it evens out. Oops. That's it. I blame the grease. <laughs> How dare you? Grease never hurt anybody, unlike Eevee. Uh, how do I get up here again? Oh no, up there. Oops. I slip. Let's get a North Fleet and Loot Rando from a quest or a chest. Sure. There's no restrictions on what loot sources can get what items, so long as the loot source is in rando and the item is in rando, which, yes, the North Fleet is. And yes, there are chests that are, or quests. That slap just blew up my buzzard without even looking at the explosion! But I... I ain't scared! I'm coming down and you're gonna die! 
<clears throat> I don't think I ever got one twister, and that was after three hours of triple O, and you get it from a stupid box? Yeah. <laughs> wow, not even one stack. Nice. I think we did learn mortars before, didn't we? Winter's over. Oh, yeah, yeah, we just checked. Right. There isn't that bad? Yeah, I'd say that's about expected. Or from Triple O, and Gwen said could do it for you. What, um,. What options did you select in your seed? My boys are gonna come in and steal the explosives. Short term memory problem? Oh yeah. Uh, also first. like, you know, massive Take inundation with details problem. Like we've done 200, 300 checks or something. And total. This playthrough. Oh! You know, I probably should have thought of that. I could get away with using other weapons, but let's not risk it. Let's <laughs> let's not throw away this life that we earned in the Godliath couple fight. Oh, jeez. Okay, but like, hold on. That guy has fire. Humby, <laughs> hello. Great to see you. How's it going? How's it? Good, got some work done. How day for you? Hey, really good. This is the most fun I've had in one life and ever. Um, are you kidding? Okay. Now mark those crates for pickup, and my boys will come and get them. They'll need those charges to blast open the path to the info stockade. Swap again. Element specific guns. <laughs> it still says collect hand of grease. Wait, there, it's back. Kale just says, decided not to work tomorrow. Right. Well, good. <laughs> Maybe I'll decide not to work tomorrow. Except that would mean that I wouldn't make any money tomorrow. But yeah, Kale can do it.
I also hate like an eater. Sorry, missed you. How you doing? Keep your head down, Slab. My boys are starting their run. That ought to do it. The way to the info stockade is open. Hey, what we um? Uh, Hunter Hellquist. Oh, we haven't done Hellquist yet. Okay. Uh, and then this just in. Haven't. All right, let's do Hellquist then. I mean, a break from Mopey would be nice. <laughs> you wish. Not bad. Can't stop. Yeah, oh yeah, wait, hold on a second. That's right. You were supposed to be gone. I said, see you tomorrow. It's not tomorrow. Hey, Slab. Good luck, Slab. Like I said, instead of punching, I prefer to keep my Who are you distance talking from to the right target. Now? Pick my moment. You've been listening. I swear, we did do Hellquist. And that was on the accident. We just not write it down at all. It's my biggest crit. I don't really have anything. Yeah, I mean all of all of normal movies before Tracker. Legendary pistol. He was the Herald. That's right, we had a level 29 Herald for Warrior on this character. Right. Yeah, it's impressive that, um, VS Code knew to fill in unkempt, and then after a few more letters, Herald. <laughs> Guess it pulls from English Dictionary for plain text files. Stinky Herald. Yeah. I definitely don't need one. Anyone remember at all what this just in gave? I mean, there's an even easier Herald form. Yeah. Well, we didn't write it down, so it probably wasn't worth writing down. Not a Herald. Are you... Sh how do you know? It could have been a Herald. Uh, you know, we got, um... Uh, in memoriam, this seed... Giving Shotgun 1340, while Bowl, during the mission, also gave sh 1340. Would have remembered it. What makes you say that? Yeah. Head to one of the pumping stations. Slab! Mordecai! I made it to the Hyperion outpost! Just give me some time and I'll steal a drop barge. Mm -hmm. Once y'all find out where the warrior is, we can all good. We can all good. <laughs> all good. Stay 
communications and raise the pressure to that pipe's fit to burst. Press the pipe, get to the stockade, and find out where the warriors are. Hey, buddy, it's me, Roland. Let's kill mm, a handsome like... Jack and then we'll all go out for Roland, shh. Things. Roland, Roland, be quiet. No, I'm just playing. Jack, Don't now you be there. quiet. Grab his echo unit you know, when I left. Just wanted to tell you that Lilith is doing a bang-up job charging the vault key for me. The warrior will be away in no time. I've had two heralds for warrior. Not full drug swapping. <laughs> right. Get the fastball. That's from Dan, uh, one of the Ninja Turtles. Blessed Dan. Thanks, Dan. <clears throat> Which is um, not ideal because it's not a very good one life farm, the Ninja Turtles. Uh, and it is a pretty important item, so like. Ugh. At least he didn't use a hyphen this time. That's the worst. When you, like, prove that your puns are puns by hyphenating the stolen syllable. <clears throat> oh, God. No! Okay, we're okay. Dan into trading drops with someone else. Oh, that'd be awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, hey, Dan, you know, uh, that face McShooty guy, you know, his, the item he gets to hoard is pretty good. You know, you'd probably like that. Okay. Quick overview of checks here. Um, Bonehead is the Rex. Saturn. Saturn. Purple grenade? Don't know it, but fine. Um, Uncle Teddy, Crack Sash, Remington's Edge? Fine. Get to know Jack, Purple Specialist Com? Fine. Hungry like the Skag gives the Neo. Hmm. Okay, well, we don't need anything here. Unless, am I forgetting any enemies? All right, let's go. Every bit of data in the Hyperion Are network those space pants? Stega, hey dude. Space. Your butt is from space. Thanks for forever. Like, you know, the most. Thanks for forever the most. Thanks for the... Tier 3, still to this day, dude. Appreciate ya. Hey, how you doing? What you been up to? What's your life like these days, man? Are you winning? I'm not losing. sucks and the turret is useless 
<laughs> yeah, we're winning. more nades than this I from the like you know crazy power. amount of you get that. ammo here <clears throat> and i'm sure he had to exploit her for profit and power too don't listen false hunter he killed angel long before you pulled the plug perfect yeah don't you dare speak about my daughter. your lady of this form <laughs> is in saturn you're winning that's like um that's the that's ucp isn't it what's up you saw with the twister it's weird it, it does work the splash on the twister which is like a good chunk of the twister's damage doesn't get money shot because it's nade splash and the money shots picky and then also um deputy Sal is like really crit centric and the twister is not So it's like, it works, but it's not good. At least not, you know, compared to the rest of Deputy Cell. Which is... Yeah. Yeah, Twister's Nade Splash, 80%. Okay. We'll hang out. grenade splash. Harold Twister, even breathing. <laughs> Breathe on somebody. <laughs> they start <laughs> exploding. <laughs> there. Jack sent all the iridium he's mine straight to Fuck the that Harold particular. No, 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 no. I choose to um uh take that barrel for my own gain. He was a patsy. Question, does the Slag Betty work for Slag Marcus mission? Yep. Anything does, of the element. It doesn't even have to count as your damage, technically. Like, you could throw your turret, and uh, the turret could get it, just as long as, like... Okay. Uh, the, like, guy gets hit by that element. <laughs> Impressed my bosses by programming a difficult part at work. Everything going smoothly, first try, so I'm feeling pretty good. That sounds sounds like you were they're rightfully impressed. First try, look at you. Part, you mean literal like machine part, like uh, uh you program the CNC for a particularly intricate part. This ends Jack Lilith and a warrior are in heroes. Can I can do it? Yep. That's where we headed. This is the final fight, amigo. If you gotta prepare, do it now. Go check around the city. These people don't have much, but they still want to help you. Hyperion's locked the entrance to Heroes Pass. Get back to Claptrap. We need him to open the way for you. Smoker's cough, extra damage. No, that's like that's like poison debuff or like fire debuff or something. I think like explosing, explosive cough would be like whooping cough. I should have filled up on shotgun. That's okay. Hey, Nike. How you doing, dude? Sorry, Nike. Nike. Okay, it's like 90% chance it's Nike. Hyperion's gonna regret 
Should I go on a plane to go see my partner? I'm excited about that too. No kidding. You know, we've never discussed this aspect of your life before. It applies extra damage was looting me. I just knew it should. <laughs> it's smoker's cough, yeah. Hey, Pixel, how you doing, dude? How'd you sleep? Those are just Airbus rather than Boeing. No, everything's fixed. They fired the CEO. All good. I slept good last night. Dispatching additional troops. No! Don't dispatch more troops! I'm sorry! I'm sorry, pretty female voice! Just cover me, minion! In the UK. I'll say the same as I'm sure. Yeah. Not good. <laughs> I'm not gonna try. Delta had an engine fall off during takeoff today. Seriously? The Boeing plane, I'm, I'm guessing. So, okay, actual question. The fact that this has been happening so frequently. I know uh, airlines don't actually just buy new planes that frequently, you know, they have them in service for decades or whatever. Why is it that all of a sudden, so many Boeing planes are having issues all at once? DXVK files are D3D now exclamation point Vulcan with a K. But actually, yeah, those two. Just um, make sure they use the right versions of those two. Yes, you may have a 64-bit PC, but you need the 32-bit versions. Oh jeez. With PC. Man, that's a lot of RAM. Well, my processor has 512 bit registers for specific operations, so there. I think I missed the context of this, huh? My PC has pretty lights on it and turns on when I press the button. Just like I ask it to. So... <laughs> I have to look back at your message to know what syllable to say. Start at zero, it's probably your second least played. Oh, no kidding. Mm, do you feel that, child killer? Hmm? The key's nearly charged. 
Uh, yeah, true. Thumbs, right? When you think murder, think Marcus Munitions. Made key to two words, my friend. No reason. Damn, you look like a handsome movie protagonist in that clip. <laughs> the funny thing is that <laughs> you bringing that up illustrates the distinction from how I look now. <laughs> oh man, dude, for real. Handsome movie protagonist, I ain't. I just asked mine to play The Sims, and it does. Oh, Pesty, you're, that's true. Right now, I actually cannot ask mine to play The Sims. It lacks that functionality. Somehow, me and my PC will figure out a way to carry on. That's fucked. Please don't shoot me. Okay. Good. Did you install the Sims? No. And while that may explain it, I, um... Not gonna investigate at this time either. Okay. I'm pushing, Brick. I'm pushing. One faces two problems right now. One is. Their most recent gener generations of aircraft, in large part because of subcontracting and profit maximization, are just kind of crappy. Yeah, okay. They got sloppy with their current supply chain vendors. Hold on. Smooth heroes pass. Anyway, got sloppy with their supply chain vendors. Uh, things used to be done in-house. Subcontract it out, didn't create the quality control mechanisms they needed to, yeah. Um, it comes down to me to save this world for such a, like, but more uh, crucial you. application, too. You'd really think that, like, uh, airline or, or uh, aeronautics would be you know, kind of the one field where, you know, it would be safe from that phenomenon. But I guess even Boeing. Everybody's infrastructure costs are going up a little short. Uh, going up in a little shortcut here in inspection and there in inspection. Okay. Does lead to things falling off. Not Boeing's fault, but the air, for sure, right? It would be as much of a problem if Good quality control from the get anyway high quality low prices and no questions asked. hello digmatizing how you doing all right so
I think that's probably like how we could finish him off the fastest. Get an orc stack or two while distracted by turret. Yeah. This is where it all. Also, kill skill and cleaning up the jacks. Once Lilith here charges the key, I'll control the warrior and wipe you bandits off my planet. When you get to hell, tell your vault hunter friends I said hey. <laughs> Button for butcher butts. <laughs> Going up a little butt cut here in inspection. They're in inspection. Doesn't lead to things falling off. No bow butts fall really, but their aircraft. Yeah, you. Hey, butt spots up on current on events. Key's nearly ready, but before I cleanse this planet for good, butt cuts. I'm gonna <laughs> Everyone's got one butt cut. Kill that freaking commando! Remember listening to a podcast about plane accidents, and they mentioned something being caused by screws that were 0.03% undersized. First thought was, wow, that's very small, but the host continued on to say, which doesn't sound like a lot. Yeah, of course, right? I, Without you telling me, I'm going to guess that the reason that's uh, so impactful is because the plane is literally constantly vibrating. And so any tolerance, um, you know, translates to uh, uh, movement um, quicker than you'd expect because of that constant super vibration. <clears throat> Kill. Okay. Next. Uh, sure. Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. Thanks, antagonist. Oh. Also, that should be fastball. Oops. Lawrence is your use to 0.05%. Wow, no, or 0 0.05 inches, sorry. get the kill, but it's not going to be fast. I don't really have anything fast. Yeah, warrior, smash him. Where, where are you going, warrior? I done. <laughs> uh, boop. There we go. Oh, God, I hope that's that cycle. I wanted to have to do a whole other one. Okay, good. Be 
surprised though how sloppy the fit feels. Oh, okay, even just by hand. Yeah, no, you're right. I have like no real way of visualizing like what point oh three means. Um, yeah, you, know, you know, like how humans aren't very good at like really comprehending huge numbers, like you know, ten to the thirtieth power. I think it's small numbers. I don't know what, you know, point oh one or oh three inches translates to. Did we actually get to learn Warrior's Legendary Shield, or no? Settings still revert back to low every time, and I just fully underinstalled the game. Well, it wouldn't be in the game. You know, like, the, there's nothing user changed in the game files at all. It would be that thing, you know, for example, and I'm not saying this will fix it, but, like, you know, what I was talking about where, uh, you know, you go to your... Uh, uh, documents, you know, my games, Borderlands 2. It would be in here. All you have to do, and, 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 you know, uh, I can't, I don't know if you actually pulled the trigger on trying this or not, but rename this folder to Borderlands2.back or something. Just, just do that with the game closed, relaunch the game. Someone who's getting into the proper nitty-gritty of BL2 Endgame, yeah? Why do you keep dropping your weapons? Uh, it, um, refills their magazine, and it also swaps between them faster. Up to you whether you find that fun or not. I find it fun because, uh, while it does undermine the intended developer balance of the game, it's doing more things and getting a, like, notable result from it. It's, it's genuinely more fun for me. Like, you know, it's faster than normal swapping weapons, it's faster than normal reloading, but it takes a little more effort, and it's less waiting on animations and shit, you know, it's just fun. This is the end, Vault Hunter. Either you kill Jack, or I'll kill him for you. What's it gonna be? One one hundredth of an inch is like a quarter of a millimeter? Oh, okay, yeah, that is big. Mm. Gotta keep the APM! No, legit! Like, you know, you joke, but more APM is fun. Like, doing more little things in combat is fun. Good going, Vault Hunter. You are a badass. Show us there's a level 9 is 30%! Yeah, 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 yeah. If you got a higher grade one, surely it would be better. Um, I think grade makes a huge difference, even at low levels. But, yeah. Okay. What do we want to do to prep? Okay, I think you might have been right. I know! <laughs> Why didn't you listen to me? <laughs> it's the third time I've have to told you I've had to tell you to try doing that. <laughs> I straight up never told me that. That is actually the exactly third time I told you to do that. You just weren't listening. That is literally the third time I told you. <laughs> maybe maybe I didn't explain it right before. Maybe I didn't um, show you the windows on screen properly so as to illustrate it. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, first things first. New antagonist. Anyway, um, doing that, moving the whole folder, obviously you'll notice you don't, like, have your save files anymore. Uh, you can just move individual things back in, one at a time, uh, until it breaks again. In which case, then you'll have, like, narrowed down, you know, which thing is, like, exactly in the Borderlands 2 folder is the culprit. Or you could just move your save files and, like, redo all of your settings and stuff. Yeah. I'm, I'm assuming, in reference to what Biznap said, I'm assuming that the problem that you had is actually that you had incorrect permissions of some kind on willowengine.ini, or one of the INI files. Four ways, but somebody up a nick 
wrecked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still it didn't work. Each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and Well, good. Because that was kind of scary. Subject of Endgame. Killed my first CVHM raid boss. Oh, no shit, dude. Hyperius, yeah, that is fun. Master Gee never again. <laughs> nice. Well done, man. First time at Endgame, and look at you soloing raid bosses. That shit is above and beyond. Yes, Jim did steal the cash, but we were friends. That's sad. I had put my Willow Engine on read only, and as soon as I noticed it started doing this, I took it off read only, and it never stopped acting like it was on read only. Hey, Gage, check again. Supposed to divide the take four ways. If yours gave me solo Destiny 2 dungeon up. boss vibes. Oh, so I fell into the flow of that fight pretty quickly. Oh, that's cool. Marshall Nicely done. Freeman here. <laughs> if you want to do me a solid, <laughs> yeah, can't relate. Morons up so I can get back to my nap. That know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me, uh, that'd be awesome. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Huh. Oh. oh, I didn't turn in. Heck. Um, yeah, let's respec. And also, let me get one more backpack, SDU. Get out of my face! Come back now. I get a little lonely. Um, and then where do we have riflemen? Can I get a plus six onslaught? Blue rifleman from name game. Oh boy, let's go, Hammy. Let's let's get that for this type of farming in general. Um, no, wait, hammy. No, hammy. Hello. Bully mo. Bully. Okay, first is piles, second is grenade, third is projectiles, fourth is kill. Make an automatic tracker to go along with the randomizer. Funny thing about that, um, this file that you're looking at now updates automatically, uh, every based on what you see. So like DXVK is still there. Your saves, the SDK with mods in it, all there as well. There is no way that your saves are, would still be there after you moved the entire Borderlands 2 folder. How did you do that? What did you do? Are you Monglet? Yeah. Yeah. No. Version 1.1 added automatic tracking um, by means of a text file that gets written to. And thank God, too, because, like, doing the cataloging manually was fun for, like, you know, ten minutes. Oh. Wait. Done. Bloody balls. Oh, sod it. 
I'm so sick of coming up with names for you know what? Bonafart. All of the vets right, we're calling them Bonafarts now. Oh wait, just, just kill a few, a few of them. Of them or something. I don't care anymore. Documents my games like you showed on screen, fix that issue as well. Okay. How did your save files? Oh, you know, you probably have Steam Cloud on. Holy shit, turn that off before it fucks you over. You do not want cloud saves through Steam. It will delete things eventually. What are Steam Cloud? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I didn't even think of that. Yeah, no. That's it. Steam Cloud, Steam Cloud attempts to make its best guess at any given moment, um, which uh, is the most correct version of your saves. Its version or the version on your hard disk. And if it gets wrong, goodbye version on your hard disk. I feel like general advice just for, I have heard of it happening on PS5 as well. I don't know about Xbox. But I would say that's probably just good general advice. My publisher says I can't call them Anytime it's done that it's asked you. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, that's good. Steam number one rogue. I've heard at least I've heard, I think probably one horror story, which definitely not a very significant data pool. It's just it freaks me out. That what you just said is pretty reassuring. That it um, has happened, but it has asked you for confirmation, which is the right way to do it. Yeah. <clears throat> Tells you the end time. Okay. Onslaught. Yes! You leave Cloud Sync on for like everything except BL2. Hmm. Okay. Oh, and now respect for Gemini. I built to Steam and why I switched to Epic. Uh-huh. I don't know if you remember, a long time ago I had an error with the game and after fresh installs it kept using the corrupted EXE and never fixed itself. It shouldn't do that for the EXE. Um, the EXE should be... Uh... You know, fully uh, under the guise of, like, Steam's verify game files feature. And I've never heard of that breaking. You know, like, Steam's Verify Game Files has always been, like, pretty rock solid. Colloquially, anyway. But interesting. You know if it was the EXE specifically. Oh, okay. Yo, what's up, banana? Oh my god, Gage is doing it. Oh my god, he's fucking doing it. Oh my god, Gage modding. It's time! Oh, I'm actually so excited. <laughs> Yay! We just skim through the words and absolutely uh, no, screw something up. Um, yeah, no, click the installation the instructions. It has pretty pictures and stuff. I know how much you like those. Now that only one of them will tell you the truth, the other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other pictures, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that'd be awesome. Huh. Guess Jim. <laughs> no scorched earth. Oh, oh wait. I knew I was saving those three points for something. <clears throat> the warriors disappeared. Just give me 
Just give me something to shoot. Uh, Bolt Hunter? Little help? Look, it's a long story. No, it's a short story. I write short stories. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other? Marshal Freeman here. If you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, then... Does no, Borderlands no, DXVK we'll break anything in game? Uh, it's not Borderlands DXVK. DXVK is a general uh, library. Works on any DirectX 9 through 11 game. Um, in the case of Borderlands 2, yeah, there's one thing that it breaks, which is the lava in the warrior fight does not draw correctly or at all. So when you um. When you're fighting warrior, you really do need someone there to tell you when the lava is rising. Otherwise, you're screwed. Probably don't need to update the SDK. Uh, you shouldn't, but still do. You had wait. Did you have the SDK? Okay, then I will have zero problems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Bolt Hunter? Little help. Here's version 2.5. Said that earlier. No, it's a short story. I what what version? Story? That's mod menu. What version of the SDK is that? Update the SDK. A little over a year ago to use photo mode. Oh, okay. I'm sure it'll work with Loot Rando. I don't think that there's anything in Loot Rando that requires anything more recent than that. But know that I did all of my coding on Loot Rando on a newer version, so I can't vouch for old versions. 2.5 is the most recent version of Mod Menu. Okay. Okay. Your guide said to check the Mod Menu if it's too- Oh shit, that's from Commander's Instructions. I just copied and pasted that. I gotta fix that. Oh my god, I'm gonna go fix that right now. Um. <laughs> Uh, GitHub, loot randomizer installation, uh, edit. Mm. Note that your mod menu must be a version here. Also, I could probably change that link to something slightly more useful. SDK installation. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Play this release on GitHub. VL2 mod manager. Mod menu version 2.5. Okay, so you are in the current. Let me let me just put a 5 here. Um, yeah. Just in case. You should be good. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, Bolt Hunter? Little help? Look, it's a long story. I sit in my little spot next to ammo box on the very left, and warrior and lava doesn't reach me. Just crystal enemies. Oh, dude, tell me about it. <laughs> you can fix the missing lava with the config setting. Yeah, um, you can change the float precision settings for the entire renderer to fix the lava. I don't do that because I would like to keep the recommended float precision settings for the entire game, and I don't care about the lava. Just got on slot accident, heck yeah. <laughs> wow, you're already 16. Look at you go! Should move lobby easy, yeah. Anything yeah. no, about crab champions? I know that it is um, the final um, perfect perfect evolution of champions. Eventually, all champions converge into crab, and and that it's like um, you know an arena 
uh, survival wave thing that Biznap likes. That'd be awesome. Not bad. Guess Jim did steal the cash. But we can probably do better. <clears throat> you know what occurs to me? There's other things that we should probably be farming in Sanctuary. Like, do no harm gives the lead storm. Also, we can get conference call, but how competitive is that going to be with Butcher? Um, what is conference call? Torture chairs. All right. What else is in Sanctuary? What's Birthday Bash? Chain Lightning. Oh, fortunately that's not part specific, but we gotta do it. You will help me and I will pay you. Uh, Oh, we haven't done hidden journals. So we need to, to get torture chairs if we want conference call. And I don't think I do. I think that's okay. We'd be fine doing it, but it's not even worth the time. We've got butchers. Um, we do need to do do no harm. Really good economy run going, but then I stopped gaining money. Do you want to guess how much money I had? $69. Oh! Oh, it's that kind of stop gaining money. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't think of that. <laughs> cool. Man, if you could have only gotten one more dollar, it would have been a nice round number. Hey, good on them for actually having it stop there instead of then going to negative two one four seven four eight three six four eight. I tell you, idiots, you Etc. by swallowing this stuff. Well, that shard ain't no good in the black market. It didn't refine yet. You could probably... Why would they have your money stored in a signed integer, though? After hours of... Oh, that's... Holy shit, that's a good blood story. <laughs> Heck yeah. What are mob farm enemies? That isn't chubbies, is it? No, not chubbies. Um, here. Uh, this is also in the GitHub page, but... Exclamation point loot sources. Control F mob farm. And, uh, you'll get an idea. I didn't read, sorry. No, that's okay. You read the instructions page. I never told you to read the home page. Looks like the hiding space in my super secret stash just fell apart. It's my birthday. I first rolled off the assembly line seven years ago. Literacy strikes us all. He read the instructions and he got the mod up and running first time by being extremely literate with the instructions. Give him some credit. Did he come back here and was like, uh, the mod's not working. I, I think I followed the instructions. No, no, he nailed it. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid, yes, he did. Wait, did he? Oh. Moby, so <laughs> Poopy, and you ain't bad on the door. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me. Grits will even point out. Wait, did he actually? <laughs> did I have a typo? Oh, the, no, you mean the um, mod menu version thing. That's true. That actually is representative of like very good attention to detail probably more than i i've ever paid to instructions
This is a message to any Crimson Lance left on. Oh, sorry, I can't make it. It's Claptrap, my love, though. My purely platonic love. Don't want him getting any ideas. Poopy has a good insult. I like dingus. Personally. Fuck yeah, Marcus. I'm running back to Claptrap so fast! Double check. Yeah, yeah, no, true. And uh, that's... That's legit, because, you know, people... Uh, and very much I'm including myself in this, who feel overly confident tend to skim things. And then we get bitten by it. Is yours body double attend yeah. Claptrap's party for you? Get over here. Uh, uh, my being there in spirit can attend the party for me. Operating assistant. All right. Small and shame, just below the stern. You say dickhead a lot at work. Oh. <laughs> I would have expected that to be where you say something like dickhead less. <laughs> An iridium shard offer. How many times I tell you idiots, you can't get slag powers by swallowing this stuff. Well, that shard ain't no good in the black market. It didn't refine yet. You could probably take it to that tannis lady on the other side of town. She's still free to mingle with, um, nobody. Like the fill-in option for that? Oh, isn't it just... So nice now that we actually have that. Uh, there's, um, some pizza. Uh, I'll take it to the Sorry about that. I also want to point out this will be the first time I've played the game casually in literally so many years. Yeah, when's the last time you even played any game casually? Uh, but also, not to ruin. You playing casually, I have been having so much fun with this as permadeath. Back whenever I need a lead storm. Thanks for um, thanks for coming to my party, minion. It uh, looks like I bought way too much pizza, so uh, take some home if you want. Hey, Roland's boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. This love one life loot ran by the skill tree rando. Yeah, yeah. The thing about skill tree rando is it's not fun unless you roll something fun. And I wouldn't want to do that for one life. I wouldn't want to be like, okay, I'm going to do one life, and then I keep, like, pressing, like, the re-roll button until I get something that I like, you know? Um. Yeah. Actually, wait a second. Yeah, I think the optimal thing to do is save, quit after talking to. No, wait. Okay, run to Tannis? Or run to Zed? Relax, everybody. Waiting on Zed is like the slowest part. Actually, the, I guess it would be optimal. Oh, that's good. It'd be truly optimal if we could figure out a way of skipping dialogue for BFFFs. BFFs. Other B, F, and S mission. Looking for work? Hey, Roland's boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. Messed up his lungs. Dude needs surgery bad. Get over here. You're gonna be my operating assistant. 
Supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, then know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me. Uh, oh, this is so long. It was different in the old days. This dialogue isn't required like ever with the mod on. Huh. Why am I so unlucky? For me, Zed's dialogue always plays and it never conflicts with anything. He always talks over whoever else might be talking at the time. Or vice versa, if someone else starts talking, he just keeps talking. It doesn't bother him. Try punching anyway. I've been doing that. Alright, I've I've been done trying that. But I'll try it again. You need cat? Hey, those boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. Sucks to be Mopio. I know! You're just making me feel more bad about myself. We don't want to nick. Uh, Bones Hunter? Little House? Look, it's a long story. It's a short story. I like short stories. Well, plus, I am enjoying this little mini game of running back and forth. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, then. Know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me, uh, that'd be awesome. Wait. What if? If we pick up Zed, then save quit. That order. Looking for work? Hey. And then we run to them. Mm. No, it doesn't really make sense. So try. I just gave myself the super secret version of Loot Rando that includes more dialogue. Four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop it in the head for me, uh, that'd be awesome. Hey, Arch, how goes the farm? Good, we're just doing laps around Sanctuary right now. Huh. Guess Jim did steal. 28! Wow! My game, the kickoff dialogue often plays twice. Huh? You need cash. Hey. Once for a split second, then a second time for the whole thing. But the first time counts and lets you actually Yeah, right, right, right. No, that that's why. That's the difference, sure. Is that triple torg? No, I saw a doll part and a torg part. I didn't, I didn't actually look at them all. Yeah, I agree, Kale. Right, I don't have that like concern right now. An iridium shard offer. How many times I tell you? Uh, uh, Vault Hunter, no little help. Look, it's a long Didn't story. No, it's a short story. I write short stories. I write short stories. We're supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. 
Marshal Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap. Your chubby drop is purple no, pointman point comms. No, that's a good thing. That means you don't have to farm chubbies, dude. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me. Uh, a purple turf shield from the first boss of the game is kind of funny. <laughs> also, hey, that's kind of cool. It's like not too overpowered. Sick. We don't want you, Gage, Master Borderlands 2 gamer, to, like, have it too easy. Loot midget drop is the leech. Good. <laughs> no time Zed says get over here. I think he's going to continue the Krieg line. This, uh, get over here so I can. Oh. Shit, what does Krieg say? After hours of. Come on back whenever you need some healing. As long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus, anyways. I know the line you're talking about, but I don't even remember the words. Smell my meat. Okay. <laughs> I mean, if you're asking, I will. Hey, Rollins boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. Looks like they messed up his lungs. Dude needs surgery bad. Get over here. You're gonna be my. Get over here so I can say blah. <laughs> we were supposed to divide to take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those no, idiots still. An iridium shard. How many times I tell you, you can't get slapped no, 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 hours by swallowing this stuff? Well, that shard ain't no good in the bottom of the box. You can refine that. We could probably take you to that tent. She's on the other side of town. She's real into that iridium stuff. Mm. I'm gonna over here so I can say black. <laughs> I wonder what it's like. Also, you're playing Axton. <laughs> After hours of scientific Axton. Come on back whenever you need some healing. As long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus, anyways. <laughs> Let's turn music. Just missing fire. We have a really good corrosive one and a good non elemental one. I don't actually need really good of anything, I just want a fire one. Hey, Roland's boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag. Zero question for Zero Man. Which one? There's like a couple here at least. Several, even. Hey, Gas, how you doing? Oh, we didn't do this. Whoops. Alright, make a small incision just below his sternum. Careful, we don't want to nick the coronary artery. What's up, Cass? <laughs> yeah, we are. Uh, it's the only interactivity I have during this farm. Can you probably bore if you're on grenade? No. Rule of thumb is if it can't crit, it can't bore. And fake crits that your grenade does to like crystalisks or skag mouths uh, don't count. After hours of Come on back whenever you need some healing. As long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus anyways. You can bore Krieg. Checkmate. Uh, sorry. Clarifying. I'm talking about the weapon, but yeah. You bore if you're on grenade, any of them. Yo, you mean like use your grenade as a hitbox to bore through? No. No. No health bar. Okay, I guess that's not a good rule of thumb because there are things that don't have health bars, but inexplicably you hear bore sounds when you bore through an enemy to them, but. True, your own grenade, the bullet penetrates and goes through its. Yeah, no. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshal Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that. 
Now that only one of them will tell you the truth, the other three are I don't know why I just bored Tector then. He has Jimbo in his shoulders. One of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me. Uh, that'd be awesome. Sam's full of cash. Without question. After she and O'Cantler were mm. done celebrating our success. It was already dead. Surely there was just another enemy. Or something. Keep waking up the marsh. I know! He can't get a good nap in when I'm around. Oh, I didn't turn in. BFFs. Dead run. After Come on back whenever you need Again? As long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus anyways. Why do I keep forgetting to turn in BFFs? I guess it's like two really like you know uninteresting steps: shoot guy, wait, turn in. Singer, oh fun, oh one of those guns where it's like even if you know it was you would never farm for it, but it's fun. But you would never farm for it. Even if you could, you wouldn't farm for it. Oh wait. And now, you get to have the fun. <laughs> do any DLC checks? Yeah, Headhunters. Um, haven't done any campaign DLCs. We'll be doing those first thing in UVHM. Well, I guess I shouldn't say first thing. We're probably first thing going to get far enough in UVHM to have a foothold for... Um, in case we don't get... Other farmable weapons in the DLCs fast enough to keep our head above water for UVHM leveling. What did I pick up? Okay, no, we're at Tannis for this part. This is pretty good in this mod? Yeah. You know, if I have a safe way of farming the kings, for example. Didn't turn it. Yep. I can see that on my screen. Yep. I feel bad. Stop giving me good corrosive! Found the beat? Nope. No B, no Grog. Yes, Layuda. And honestly, I should probably get Layudas. I should probably get more Orc. I should probably get a level 50. Um. Uh, Soldier for the 10 in Expertise. A somewhat working death trap build. There's actually a stupidly overpowered death trap build, believe it or not, that is only held back by death traps AI. Um, it has enough damage to kill raid bosses, but it doesn't because death trap doesn't use his melee against raid bosses. Um, if you spec this capstone for gauge and this capstone for gauge and give death trap a element and a Roid shield, he just destroys anything. Any mob that he chooses to melee at OP10. Ultimate badasses, whatever. They just disappear. Yeah, right. The problem is when he decides, no, I can never melee this. Let me use my eye laser. That does zero damage. Can you get a mod death trap at the eye? That actually exists? Yeah, yeah. Biznap and I have memed with it. I've memed with it. That's how we know that it kills raid bosses. What are we farming? Um, uh, antagonists from Jim Kepler, and uh, while we're at it, killing time by getting lead storms from Tannis and Zed. How's it going, Jolts? How was your day? What'd you find today? What'd you find? 
crossover. I found eight pearls from B1 Cry. Oh, that's good. <laughs> um, but, you know, are you going to tell us which ones? Or... Oh, I didn't do it again! God damn it! Okay, was seven of them uh, Nemesis Invader? Want to gauge overhaul mod? There are several of them. Um, I've never tried any of them. Various, you know, like mod packs include them. Various, like, overhauls include them. Gauge is, you know, a very good target, obviously. For uh, overhauls. Any of them actually good? Oh, I'm sure they are. I'm sure all of them are to some extent better than vanilla gauge. But I don't know, I can't actually specifically vouch. I, I haven't run any of them. Half guns, half shields. In all my time. After hours of science. Farming pearls, which isn't that much. All I ever wanted was any of the shields, and I never got any of them. No rose, no Iron Man. Iron clad. You can have fun with the eye laser if you stack enough shock kill skill. Raptor, did you think about that before you said it? What's what's wrong with what you just said? Bro. I found Bane yet. Have we? In this seed? 67 Evo! <laughs> okay, see, that seems OP. Until you realize that you're about to get, like, seven levels immediately. And then you can't find another shield because, like, there's, like, just not enough shields in the game. Mm -hmm. Anything fun with the eye laser and chaotic teams? Oh! Sorry, Raptor was responding to you asking about chaotic teams. That's an interesting question. Yeah, we never tried. I wonder if you could actually have enough shock damage for it to work. Four gauges. Uh, four zapper comms. Eleven points. What would be, that'd be, um, 33 times 4, uh, 11 times 12, 120, 132, 132 percent shock damage. I don't think that would be enough to make, uh, Death Trap's eye laser do anything. Is there any other buffs that it would get at all besides just elemental damage skill? Zero. No, it's like zero would just give ambush. Oh, wait. That was close. Up. Oh. Hey, corpse. The number is zero. <laughs> there you go. You're excited to check out these guns I never use. I'm really excited for you to check out these guns you never use, and I'm really excited for you to do these missions you never use and farm these bosses you've never farmed. Oh, oh wait, nope. Seriously, can I just get a fire lead storm so I can take this out of the equation? An iridium shard. Are these eye laser not shock dot? I mean, stuff. shock dot? You think that, like, uh, enough, uh, no, it's a short story. dot, di shock dot short damage stories. would do it? We were supposed to the that would be, like, more significant than buffing the impact damage uh, with wires don't talk? I, 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 I'm really skeptical, but it's like, I don't know. I don't know how much of DT's shock laser is 
shock dot versus shock impact. No, so the bone doesn't share, which is why I didn't save awesome. that. The reason I was like focusing on wires don't talk is because chaotic teams shares that. Doesn't share like relics. Are those yeah. space the shock that also costs fire. That's an interesting question. Space. Your Does is from space. Um, electrical burn share in chaotic teams properly, yeah. or does it not work? Like cloud kill doesn't work, or uh, uh, immolate doesn't work. No way. <laughs> hey, Evie. Thanks, dude. It's real sweet of you. Even after all the mean things I said. <laughs> Seriously, thanks for getting Tombstalker. Appreciate it, Jeff. Tombstalker, enjoy. Thanks to our dear Eevee. He's creeped above the fire. Come on back whenever you need some healing. I do wonder, what would be the ultimate shock dot? Or, sorry, ultimate dot setup in chaotic teams. Gage has a lot of dot damage. Krieg has some fire dot damage, but not much. Krieg has a stupid amount of dot chance. Like, a stupid amount. So, maybe you'd probably want one Krieg, at least, just for the chance. And then the rest could be gauges, or some mix of gauges and Kriegs. Gage, you know, she's got, like, Catalyst, and Catalyst boosts Evil Enchantress. The Gage would need to always get kill skills. Actually, so would the Krieg. Every Dude, all of the dot damage skills in this game are kill skills. You would have four people needing to maintain kill skills. No matter what mix of Kriegs and Gages. And I know Reapers, there you go. And the Reaper does boost Fuel the Fire, his dot chance skill. Okay. Alright, we're working it out. It's it's going somewhere. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that... No, that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are Yeah, at least one Krieg, if not which one of them more the Krieg. Maybe we'll get to learn. Maybe we learn something. Yeah, we learned the gym. Uh, what a triple bandit antagonist looks like. Turret, go hide. Remember I loaded in a game once, and a hacker had spawned hundred legendaries on the floor. He had to make a hole in the floor to fall through. Ran and grabbed as many as I could before I got kicked. Uh, oh. Cool story. Uh, unfortunately, um, you didn't uh, harm them or their fun, but boy, did you try to for some reason. Supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If Love getting hit with the dot. That almost 100% of the time health gates you. Oh, yeah, that too, right. So here's the problem with the setup that we're talking about to make dots do something in chaotic teams. Dots already do do something huh. to the player, to the extreme. But we were <laughs> I guess, you know, in that regard, what difference would it make? Mm. Scared of a little tetanus anyway. 
I'll play Gage again and we'll find out. Yeah, there you go. What are you farming? An antagonist and a fire lead storm. color does lead burn anyway that's a you know that's an interesting question because that actually is a thing right like different uh oxides burning different colors that's how fireworks work different metal oxides yeah what is lead blue white oh okay is that the real answer you just knew that or looked it up Google. <laughs> Google. <laughs> Gage, why haven't you said anything in the last two minutes? I need to know more. There he is! <laughs> that hair day hammerlock gave me a sniper! And Claptrap gave me a shotgun! Hey, no way! <laughs> After hours of Dude, that was crazy. Right as I said that, your message appeared for me. Hold on, what was mine? I feel like actually that happened to me in one of my seeds, or was that with business? No, maybe it was someone else. Bad hair day. Nukem? Oh no, in my seed, they both gave me a Torg launcher. It's just that one of them was purple and one of them was orange. Fun <laughs> fact, the elephant gun sucks. No, it doesn't. At level five. Use that shit. Yeah, sure, it'll be okay. yeah, I think, I think, um, you know, r Loot Rando will give me an opportunity to enjoy Gage in a new way. Gage and her, you know, like, weird gear dependencies might actually be a lot more interesting in Loot Rando. And it's like, if you can't get progression and variety and gauge gameplay, at least you can get it through loot while playing her. Thinking about loot rando gauge? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Biznap, do you want to just do every run ever again with loot rando? Huh. Guess Jim did steal the cash. But we were friends. That's sad. But maybe we it's the same. Maybe we learned something. Yeah, we learned that Jim stole the cash. I think I'll stick with bigger but slower. Nope. <laughs> Looked into incorporating loot rando into archipelago. Um No. But But But, I, um, it would be possible. After hours of Come on back whenever you need some healing. Um, I know it would be possible because I know Archipelago works with web sockets, and I actually, just on sheer coincidence, happen to already have web sockets working in the SDK. Looking for work? Hey, Rollins boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to but dude, let's at least just do like bingo first, you know? Get over here. You're gonna be my operating assistant. Side note, um I created a channel in the loot rando discord for spamming uh bingo things if you have ideas for squares. Uh and and whatnot. Spam away. Also, I don't actually know that much about Archipelago. I know that it's used for, like, um, you know, cooperative features. Huh. 
or like in um uh inter game features so like what's your vision for archipelago loot rando exactly spell it out for me after hours of come on back whenever you need some healing as long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus anyways Looking for hey, Roland's boys caught this hot period dirt bag trying to sneak into the city. Is Loot Rando Discord? Yeah, it's, it's linked from the um top of the Loot Rando GitHub main page. Yeah. The vision is Link holds a Norfleet over his head and Link to the past. Yeah, right, right. There's a posting channel? Uh, there is a place to shitpost. Um, in general. Like, in the universe, and it's not a channel that you have there in that Discord, so... The answer is yes. I already gave the best idea. What more do you want from me? Better ideas. Better than the best. It's called Reddit. <laughs> After hours... Come on back whenever you need some oh my god! At least we haven't gotten shock either. But that is our third slag. And we're up to three corrosive. Today's green and purple travesty day. Hey. Hey, Roland's boys caught this high period jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. It's like they messed up his lungs. Dude needs surgery bad. Get over here. I'm just getting all of the shields. Okay, that's a good question. Why? Because that's not how it works. Big boom blast. You got a big boom blaster seed on Axton? You get to level an Axton with big boom blaster? Oh. I'm still looking for mine. Just saying. I have to text her DM Mopey shit posts. He just leaves me unread. <laughs> As opposed to what? Reading them? <laughs> A turtle to your shield, Evo, big boom blast, stuff. Okay. So here's the thing. Um, like, the, your biggest drought in After most loot rando oh, runs... Man, there's shock! <laughs> your biggest drought in most loot rando anyways. runs is shields, and um, you're using up a bunch of your shields early. So, like, good luck for the rest of the run. Yeah, no, we haven't touched DLCs. Um, there's so many more checks to go in in this seed. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my... Did put on the repeat items? Yeah, no, so, I mean, I've been running repeat items. Side note, I've actually decided that I have more fun with duds. Believe it or not. I'm going to be doing... After, after this character wins... Then I'm gonna switch to doing, uh, duplicate off runs. Um, but anyway, I digress. Even with dupes on, I still have the same drought. I've been having that drought. Oh, 
after hours. Come on back whenever you need some healing. Oh. Always oh, scared of a little tetanus, anyways. Can't say I missed the lands. How much XP have we gotten from Target Dummy? I don't. We're not getting XP from Target Dummy, right? Looking for. Hey. Yeah. Those boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag. Erica feels so good this early. <laughs> Let's done talk has convinced me. I will cancel my current run and start a new one with Diamond <laughs> Yeah, that's like another like side effect of this mod that I wasn't expecting is that people seem to come up with excuses to start new runs. Like, new game is just shockingly fun where people don't mind starting over. Over and over and over. Because even New Game has, like, you know, this, like, wonderment and, like, excitement to it. Now perform more surgery than most professional surgeons. Is that true? As, like, a professional surgeon, do you perform surgery, like, not necessarily on a, like, daily basis? I don't know. I don't know what it's like to live the life of a surgeon. Guilty of that. Ending runs for new... <laughs> That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. I just didn't see it coming. And I made that up. Damn it. I wanted to learn something. Hey, Rose boys caught this high I'll let you your next character. Play Gage and let us know what it's like. Be the guinea pig. I write short stories. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up a nick split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if okay, but not Gage. Solid, no, yes, Gage. You said let chat decide. I'm king of chat or something. I'll do it. I'm also starting over. <laughs> oh, no. Here's a question. If someone's playing another game while you're playing BL2 in Archipelago, uh, would it be on level? From where you are. Oh, wait, hold on. This part is. Okay, okay, I'll wait. Oh. Wait. An iridium shard offer it. How many times I tell you idiots? Non-elemental kitten. Oh, cool. <laughs> I've seen non-elemental slow hands. Okay. If someone playing another game while you're playing BL2 in an archipelago. But somebody up and nicked it before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid... Uh, would it be on level like for where you hand. are when you receive it, or from where in the loot pool the it is randomized from? If, you could figure out which one of them if they the sent you an item. Yeah, see, I don't actually know enough about Archipelago awesome. to feel like I can answer that. Healing. Holy shit! Of a little tetanus anyways. <laughs> Wait, a copy my seed or do you need to type it? Yeah, yeah, there you go. Edit seeds. Yeah. Huh. Guess Jim did steal the cash. But we were friends. Biskua Pow 7777QY. <laughs> That's a seed version 3. It's got the Y at the end. That's the new new. Gage is going to be the first of us to get a drop from Barlow Gutter. You will help.
Yeah, whoops. Big Moon Blaster for Birthday Bash! Oh, that's fine! Great! What backpack are you at the moment? Yep. Remote supports 36 seed versions, 64 seed versions. So they have more than one bit. Well, a bit rep a bit supports two seed versions, zero and one. Two bits supports four seed versions. Uh, zero, 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 one, one, zero, one, one, and etc. cetera. Uh, so this mod stores um, six bits, two to the sixth power, 64 seed versions. And then we can loop around and say screw you to anyone who created a seed that long ago at that point. Hey, Karma. How's it going, dude? Uh, Ever reach seed version 65? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I almost, I almost decided, um, on only five bits for the seed version, 32. Uh, but I was like, you know what, let me play it safe. And make sure that we can go all the way to 64, because we'll never hit 64, right? <laughs> Um, right now, obviously, we're making the most seed versions that we ever will, because the mod's brand new, and we have kinks to work out, and, you know, like, little things that slip through the cracks to fix that we're finding. It will slow down, you know, eventually we'll, like, never have a reason to change seed version again, because there won't be any, any more loot sources to add, or, uh, loot sources to, like, recategorize. Or at least, like, significantly fewer. Long of a story is it? To take four ways, but somebody up and yeah. and split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do a lot of work for a very mediocre burger. Oh, really? Get back to my nap. That, How so? Know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them If we don't like a change added in a seed version, uh, can we manually awesome. change that last bit to use an older version when making the seed? Uh, yeah. Yeah, you can still make new seeds in the old version. Um, if you go into seeds.py and change current version and then reload the game. Uh, it is... Uh, yeah, seed.py current version equals 3. Change that to 2 if you want to you know, use seed version 2 for some reason. Jim did steal the cash, but we were friends. Did I turn it in? Yes. Must be a story. That's true. I don't know, it's hypothetical. No, no, I know. But yeah. Uh, good question. There's an easy answer, fortunately. Stream eight hours every day. 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, 18 UTC. Eight hours. Looking for work? Hey, Roland's boy. No antagonist is enough antagonist. Uh, I'm trying to get ones that are in the 40s and not stupidly slow. And apparently that's hard. Uh, 
Flint dropped an item I don't care about makes me very happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Granted, you know, Flint is a one in three drop. It's not, he's not that bad. Better than some farms. Like, Flint's a better farm than Saturn, for example. The coast calls like a wedding. No, no. <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, Archipelago. If someone else sends an item to you, you would just receive it at current level. Um, that would probably make the most sense. That or I could make it so that it matches the level of, like, sanctuary. Such that... You know, if the player is, like, overleveled because they've been doing an insane amount of content, have it match some kind of, like, sane threshold, logical point, and that would be, like, sanctuary. After hours of Come on, back you need some like, the same level as, uh, the Marcus missions, for example. You know, those level up as the story levels up. But yeah, either that or the level of the player. I got it. Hey, Roland's boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. Looks like they messed up his lungs. Dude needs surgery bad. You get over here. You're gonna be my Retro stories. Is it who take that, right, Jack baby. Lover? Uh, yeah. Hunter, I'm just really liking how many people go to me as their operating system. Like, I'm the go to guy for that. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that, know that only one of them will tell you the truth. <sighs> what a clutch, though. Yeah, that was a really exciting fight. Figure out which one of them robbed the other and popped in the head for me. In uh, the head. Awesome. Oh my god, those eyes. Huh. Guess Jim did steal the cash. But we were friends. To be fair, you did invent Borderlands 2. I didn't invent Borderlands 2. I reinvented Borderlands 2. Thank you. <laughs> no, that was Jolt's true. Right. Good point. Really good point. Yeah. After hours of Come on back whenever you need some healing. I think there's some other guy though. Who had like the original idea? I think his name was like Bathroom or something. I don't know. Like Captain Bathroom. You need cash. Hey, Roland's boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. They messed up his lungs. Dude needs surgery. Fitting name. Get over here. That's that's why I thought of it. Uh, Bolt Hunter, little help. Look, it's a long story. It's a short story. So so someone named Bathroom would have been tempted to be all three. I missed context. You did. You missed many years of Borderlands 2 context. In the future, I should add something to Bison while we're. Oh, it was a Bison burger! Dries out really bad. Okay. So, like, what? Make a Juicy huh. Lucy out yes, of Bison? Lard? I like where this is going. Lard and Bison. Can't go wrong. And cheese. Yeah, that's a Juicy Lucy. Maybe you have a different term in, like, Texahoma. Um, juicy Lucy is where you, uh, like... Uh, make um, a burger. You you fo you uh, form the burger meat around a core of cheese. So like you know, cheese in the middle, meat surrounding it, and you grill that. You need cash, hey, Roland's boys More pig fat ground into it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, mix in some pork belly. Oh my god. Oh my god, that sounds so good. Assistant. 
no, it's a short story. I like short stories. We were somebody up and hey. naked before we could split it out. Oh, those Close idiots enough. still. An iridium shard. Do me a solid and shut the How many times I tell you it can't get slapped out of my <laughs> Zedak talking furiously. <laughs> In between, we hear Marshall say, my nap. I think some ground beef or pork sausage, just to add some fat. Right, right. I, I mean, really, to add some fat, I like my idea of pork belly. Pork belly has too much fat. And you're saying bison has too little fat, I mean... After hours... Come on back whenever you need some healing. Gage, what else have you done so far? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Uh, wait, no. Hey, Velvet. Good to see you again. Playing by Isaac. Oh, cool. How's the run going? Did you get a win? Did you do anything involving tears? Perhaps. Told you we're going to be able to story. Ugh. Let's go to Sanctuary. Well, what are your Sanctuary checks? <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing my sanctuary checks. Look, it's a long story. No, it's also, a short story. um, I like short stories. are you going to stream it? To Can I watch you play later? <laughs> today? Uh, right now? Those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that... I know that only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and pop in the head for me, uh, that'd be awesome. Uh, uh. Huh. Legendary Hoarder from Mitchmong. Hmm. That's pretty good. Not too part specific. Really could get at all times. Yeah. No, nah, I think an early game I'd prefer Hoarder. Uh, War Dog to Hoarder, but that's me. After hours? Come on back whenever you need some healing. As <laughs> long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus anyways. I wasn't planning on streaming since my own life died, but I will think about it. <laughs> you need a cat boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag messed up his lungs. Dude needs surgery bad. Get over here. You're gonna be my operating assistant. You know, I've probably messed up my lungs. I probably need surgery bad. I probably need someone to be an operating assistant. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that, no, that I do a barrel. Because I had Ludovico as Azazel. Oh, okay. Which one of them ah. And pop in the head for me. Yes. Uh, that'd be awesome. Isaac has things. Lots of things. Huh. What are lungs? Do they smell good? Hold on, let me. I'll, f I'll find out. Okay, that did not work. Can I be operating system? <laughs> I trust you with my life, yeah. I trust you with my organs. After hours. Come on back whenever you need some healing. As long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus, anyways. I'm a surgeon, but if you give me a scalpel, I'll give it a shot. Okay, you and Kandrew. Together, you got this. Hey, I got up. Hey, get that underbite going. To smell your own lungs. What is that a reference to? I'll punch you to explode your flesh. Right, I guess we have observed that that's a crucial part of surgery. Right, we see that every time. Exploding the flesh. Via punching. We were supposed to divide the take four ways, but somebody up and nicked it. Like so. Yeah, Good work, Doctor. Each other. Marshall Freeman here. If, if you want to do me a solid and shut those morons up so I can get back to my nap, that, 
Did you drop loot? <laughs> I'm exciting. Jim did steal the cash, but we were friends. That's sad, but maybe we... All right, how slow is it? Yeah, we were... we stole the cash. It's not that bad. Oh, but dude, it's smaller and slower, and it's only 1% more damage reduction. You know, maybe the one that we have right now is okay. It's just, I don't know, it's so mediocre. Like, you know, not one Hyperion part, not one Tedier part. It's only 43, but you know, all right. You have Willing, yeah, that was with, wi oh no, that was without Willing. You're right, you're right, true, it would be better with Willing. All right, I think maybe we'll just stick with the one that we have now. And, um... As much as I really still want a single... Emphasis on single fire lead storm. Maybe we give up on that. This place is such a bummer. Okay. Uh, other things. Hold on. No, well, let me see. What we have to work with. Do no harm gives purple bouncing Betty. Oh, cool. Slag Betty for Yeah, right, 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 right. Um, they're also actually kind of surprisingly good for DPS. Surprisingly, yeah. curious wow if we give up on slot now this is the most one life safe approach it's just you know significantly less fun guess i could swap one point so so we also do have Engineer, and now we can fully make use of engineer. Mm. Let's go get a singular engineer from um, Frostburn. Yeah, yeah. Also, let's um, let's vendor. Get your health and shields <laughs> right here. Uh, I think we could do better than that, and that. like really good <laughs> mm. Mm. We're not gonna use that. Get rid of these old Layudos and that and that. And <laughs> the riflemen's. Uh, wait, actually, what did, I, what did that one I just sold? That was a five four four. Yeah, I've never used the five on impact. Onslaught impact battlefront. I would use. That's our perfect one. I 
I'm being careful not to sell. Okay, keep that one. Okay, we can do this. Oh my god, it keeps highlighting that. Oh, that's so annoying. I hate- Why does it do that? It really just wants me to sell the wrong one. Whatever, just look for the star. Keep clicking until star. Okay. Okay. Sham, doctor's orders. No, that's okay. Uh, maybe later. <laughs> You're too overencumbered to run. I don't know. You just didn't didn't see me. Didn't seem like it was actually stopping me. Now, did it? If you got the money, I'll save your gold earned life. See you real soon. I'm sure. It's fat rolling for sure. What does that mean? What? <laughs> Excuse me. Savage Lee has legendary shield. Stop getting all the shield rolls now. You're screwed. Why is this game loading you with shields? Yeah, I know. Dark Souls 3 has rolls depending on your encumbrance, and the community calls those fat rolls. Fat rolling. Ah, good. Yeah, this is a problem for you, but I know I always have issues with menus in this game not behaving the way they want them to when I have a controller plugged in. Yeah, no, no. Believe me, I don't have a controller plugged in. Believe me, the real problem with this game is having a mouse plugged in. Why couldn't I have gotten a single fire one? <laughs> Pretty fucking special. Am I good? Okay, yeah. Picked up Forza. Oh, cool. Basically, best racing game. Heard good things about five. Yeah, let me actually try respecting for this. Let's try running it, even though no Battlefront. Or maybe, hmm. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 Okay. Boop, 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 Oh! It's the hide of Terra. Gage. Melee Axton. It's the law. I'm doing it. Yep. <laughs> uh, all right. Other thing. I would like to get a world burn. Um, it's lighting the match. Okay, we can do that. Any SDUs to purchase? No. Did that. Adrian can get a legit hide. True. And, or, you know, re-farmable, um, uh, love thumpers, whatever. Spikes, I come out do so much damage, yeah, right? Right, normal mode, when you can actually feel the other effects on the, uh... The enkindling is almost upon us, George! <laughs> you ever should see a porta potty glowing green, <laughs> unoccupied?
That's right, by Overlook, you'll be down to just the hot flight. Yeah, right. I don't get Love Thumper very effective on DT. Really? Do I get hit by it? Oh, I just let DT go. Like, and I stand still. You know, I call DT, um... At a distance from enemies, he flies over to them. Everything's fine. This feels pretty good. That was even without turret. What I would really like for turret would be if I had a good nade splash gun in this seed, but we don't. Still looking for Omen. We'll find Omen eventually. Okay, turret. Okay. Haha, <laughs> he went for it. Magic Missile! <laughs> I mean, it's better than anything else you got right now, right? I like this antagonist. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with this settle. Oh my god, come on. Oh. Oh. Thank you. That's the wrong number. You know, actually, we'll run a shock bone and we'll use the shock antagon uh, shock mudstorm. Fine. Okay, I like that too. Your transfusion trails track DT? Yeah, but they don't heal him at all. DT's health bar is stupid. Like, um, you know how one transfusion trail will... Uh, uh, heal, you know, a normal uh, health bar to full if, you know, the transfusion is OP 10 and your health bar is level 80. <laughs> hey, yeah, doesn't do that for DT. DT's got, you know, like, billions of health. Um, there's no real way. He gets an OP 10 health bar, but he also gets an OP 10 enemy health bar. Like, you know, tanky enemy. Boss health bar. What was max health buffs? I mean, just his base max health is, you know, like, ridiculous compared to the players. Player has, like, the smallest max health of any entity in the game. Player has, like, less max health than a barrel. Um. DT, though. You know, he's got, like, you know, a particularly beefy AI health bar. Not to mention, yeah, buffing his max health with your skills or whatever, but really it's just like, in general, his health is that big. So, um, to that effect, actually, like, I think probably the best defense shield you could give DT would be the blockade, because it gives him damage reduction on that entire health bar. That or Rough Rider, but better yet, blockade.
This is weird geometry. It's weird. No Angie! The other teams give him percent healing. No, because all percent healing is based on the health bar of the person specking the skill. Like a Mayo with elated. That's true even in chaotic teams. Oh my god, they're still in. You're mad at not me. Okay. Show you weird geometry. Where? Where on the doll has weird geometry? What if give him Abel? Well, no, so uh, the way Abel works in Chaotic Teams is when the Axton procs Abel, everyone gets the same healing that the Axton does. Really, the best thing to give him would be, like, you know, damage reduction. Um... Fine. We shall join Max Dixon. Okay. Um. What else would I want? Good on shield. Got a good launcher. Hey, Tuna. Good to have you. How are you? I think we're set. I have life tap. Okay, that would probably be a good call. DT has that much damage, he could probably heal himself if you give him percentage-based lifesteal. Yeah. Wait, what's, what's this geometry? Oh my god, that is fucking weird. Dude, what is that? What is this geometry, bro? <laughs> I think we might be good. Okay, head hurty. Oh. Yeah, I wouldn't describe that as okay, but you know, you man, man, are you being so strong? Okay. One more thing. Um, let's get a purple bandit launcher from Scooter. And then I think we start UVHM. What time is it? Okay. And I think I'm going to start UVHM. By unlocking Waddle Gobbler for Topnia and Meteor Shower. And also, you know, that's relatively safe content for us with, like, the gear we've got now. No, not you. Okay, yes, you. Uh, Bone Hunter? Little help? Look, it's a long story. No, it's a short story. I like short stories. We were supposed to divide the take... It's hard to believe, but a full Baby Maker Chuck on a Slag Dark Mercy does in fact one-shot them. Mm. Sounds like you're running other mods. Do no harm. Oh, okay. Well, uh, a thousand cuts. Wait a second. What was my Rocco's? Bad touch. <laughs> no, that's okay. Thanks, though. Anything else interesting? Just while I have this list open. Oh my god, Dukino has Pimpernel, but we're not doing that. Was the wrong click. Actually, now we could do the um, couple with uh, the world burn. Be a lot more sad, comfortable with that. Yo. I hope Gage gets um, a really important item from Medical Mystery Excommunicate. Orc, you're right. I do want better orcs. Yeah. It'll be better now because we can do like full. Uh, 
uh, uh, onslaught setup. Man, what the hell did I do? I just want you to have the full experience, Gage. My first seed, actually playing through this mod finally, I got Grog for Medical Mystery, and I tried to farm a slag, a, a Molly One Grip One, and I gave up. Hey, Wilhelm's well, done. Hey, not bad. I wasn't getting a Molly One Grip Grog, you're Krieg. Yeah, that's right. Yours is Mopwreck, isn't it? Yeah, you're good. I mean, it's Krieg. Of all the... <laughs> of all the characters to never want to farm a Grog ever again, you got the right one there. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna respec again for the farming that we're about to do here. Well... Uh, let me do... A proper build. Okay, good enough. And then we can... You. New road to do blades, log, and tinkles for CC and Grog. Oh, that's cool. I, my sweet into this here I do like this. That, like, you know, uh, uh, not only do you get different content that you want to farm, you get different, like, combinations of content that you want to farm. Like, the stupid sanctuary run that we were just doing. You know, like, uh, we wanted to farm, like, two very specific pieces of content in Sanctuary, and that was a run in and of itself that we will probably never see in another seed again. Same for you, like, uh, Blades, Log, and Tinkles as efficiently as possible per save quit. There's one redo loader 1340 mission, map reload, okay, yeah, good. Yeah, when in doubt, map reload, just like with bosses. If I really wanted to, or if I ever really want to, I could go through every single mission and fix them so that they could all be perfectly repeatable without ever save quitting, and I'm not gonna. You know what? That's good enough. Um, yeah, that's good enough. That plus world burn. Nice combo. Okay. Uh, face McShooty. Or... Flesh stick. Flesh mixsticky. The tundra here? Here. Farmhouse. Grand Edition, well, it's purple from the stock market. Hey, that's a good gun con. We got a counter for that. Why? Keep, keep counting your head. Any one with guns that shoot explosions at me? No. 
Oh my god, that guy actually does. Anyway, good for him. Rain down, bitches! Oh, we should stop using the turret. It sucks. I know. I almost got shot once there. Turret's useless. RSVP. Yes. Guest of honor is missing. RSVP every time. Okay. Okay. Longbow. I have maglock, but no longbow. That's like really weird. Yes, heard our guest too much, Bucko. I really like having quick charge. I like this right now. That was just with the rifleman, not even the engineer. Uh, and we, man, we could run around like pretty damn willy nilly. Okay, anyway. Uh, Flesh stick dropped two echoes that time, right? Where, where was Fleshy? Where'd he die? Whatever, I don't see an orc. Let's go. Should I probably make a BLCM a mod file? Do I just import what I want into a new file? Sure. Um, or you can start working with a existing file and add to it. Up to you. You can drag things into different categories, you know, to like have it. Oh. Well, we got another chance to figure out what Bartles B has. It's okay, we have a world burn. Ugh. Man, I'm getting sloppy. Did things spawn in their vanilla forces? Yeah, no, I didn't do any. Fuck! God damn it! Are you kidding me? I didn't do any special code to, like, prevent things from spawning in any location. It's completely random. Where does it go? It's completely my fault, but jeez. Frustrating. This is a really easy to spot loot beam. Like, I know other people, you know, when this happens to them, they can usually find it. Uh, my frame rate isn't that high. You know, I'm. I cap, uh. uh less than 140. That's still share one drop? Nope. No? Forget everything you know from vanilla. I, I didn't keep anything like that. There's no crowded loot pools. Assassins don't share one drop. Assassins don't each have two drops. No, that's vanilla shit. Not Lurando. Lurando, every one source gets assigned uh, one item.
Because Wat and Uni both apparently have a legendary shield. Wait, are you kidding me? <laughs> what are your settings? How'd you do this? Thirteen forty different bots? No, that's the same bot. That is loader thirteen forty. That's one guy. What cutscene skips break game? And giraffe. Yeah, I don't remember. Lighting the match. The enkindling is almost upon us. Ugh. Actually, you know what? Let's get our other fucking launcher back again, too. It's alright, we'll get a better one this time. Kinda did like that world burn, that's okay. Whatever. Duplicate I've had so far is for little Evie. Actually, I'm surprised that you already got a duplicate. <laughs> Both your 1340 bots dropped the bane. Yeah, no, no, there's one 1340 bot. Come on, come on, don't you guys know Borderlands lore? After That's one guy. Yeah, there's one check, uh, and his name is Loader1340. You put him into a constructor shell, and then you put him into a warloader shell. Uh, scooter. Anyway, Bane's a good one. I'm glad that you were able to find that so early in your playthrough, so as to be able to continuously enjoy it. How come normal engineers and Hyperius don't share a drop? <laughs> so, um, uh, at one point we made the design decision to not include every single enemy that has a name just because like you know they're unique uh like in the case of them being a unique ad in a boss fight so like you know blue the crystallisk in caustic caverns right when you fight him he's got exploding mini crystallisks so like are we gonna include those are we gonna include like hubert loopert and dupert are we gonna include um you know uh the chief in the vorek fight or the savages in the vorek fight so yeah, yeah, we didn't do those. Um, only, you know, standalone enemies, not uh, associate enemies, yeah. <clears throat> yes. <laughs> um, I got Scooter's camera, Tundra Express, Thousand Cuts. Do you include the Broken Constructor? Right, right, yeah, yeah, like Wilhelm's Cohort Constructor, right. <laughs> Anyway, if you guys disagree with the, like, loader thing, to me that made sense. But it's very possible that I'm wrong and, like, you know, uh, normal logic says that that doesn't make sense. And I could separate them. I could separate Constructor 1340 from Warloader 1340. Your brain didn't connect at first? Okay. That's that's what I'm wondering, is like, what is, you know, your instinct? What does logic dictate for you? Slightly surprised they were the same. Okay. Alright, you were expecting different. Brain didn't connect at first as well, but it makes sense now. Same guy, no doubt. This is an interesting mix. Okay. Huh. Like, it, it seems pretty 50-50 what, like, public assumption is. And I just happen to be on one side. 
Other people happen to be on the other side. <laughs> you expected the same, right, right. But then, again, plenty of people say that they expected different. Slayer of Terracom with Height of Terra- Dude! Dude! Oh my god. You are going to show off so hard to everybody just how, like, much Terra you killed? What a god. You know, I, I really, really like getting the Breath of Terra early in a run. It's fun. Nope. The Breath of Terra is like a, one of those items where it's like, it's only fun in early game. Um, and so, but you never get it in early game in vanilla, so you literally never use it, except, um, you know, the first time you killed Terra and got one so you could see what it did. Teeth of Terra's Bandit, yep. Herein is Scooter's poem for you, Daisy. Here we go. So you get one in Lou Rando and it's like, oh, dude, this thing's like just like kind of sick right now. More than that bandit lacks food Collecting all robot. Terra drops sounds like good you bingo square. Put in the bingo. Or put it in the... This cord. That's a slow a bingo square, though. Because, you know, that's like a lot of items. Maybe like, you know, three Terra drops or something. I cannot put my bone. Huh. I don't know. I, I thought I thought it was pretty good. Okay, that's a pretty good one, but we do need another one. Oh, Hi, Raxton. <laughs> I got a help fire. Hey, neat. Is that true, chicks? Do you love artsy fartsy bullcrap? Like a bandit spooning a robot? Yes. Oh. I knew Scooter was the hot specimen that I I I felt. Like, I wish I was Scooter. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> writes it down. Well, artsy, artsy, bull crap. Hey, hey, Nim. How's it going? It's perfect. Putting that in the poem. All right. My poem is done, completed, and stuff. Get back here, and I will not read it to you. Scooters fastest around town. Yeah, yeah. Ladies, ladies talk about that all the time. See. If you've picked up the Echo Note, and then you kill the enemy again, are they supposed to not drop the Echo? Hold on, hold that thought. Um, what did it say when you picked it up? I recorded my sweet nothings into this here Echo device. Just find out. I don't know, I spammed enter. You spammed enter for like five whole seconds while there was a tutorial message on screen, and now you're asking me how that shit works. Look, it's a long story. No, it's a short story. I write short stories. Whoa! The skip, dude. That's a lot of Jacobs. Before we could split it up. Oh, those idiots still screaming at each other. Marshall Freeman here. If you want to do me a solid. Anyway, uh, Gage, what you probably want is options, mods. Reset dismissed hints. So I can get back to my Next time you get a hint, you know, look at it. Only one of them will tell you the truth. The other three are liars. If you could figure out which one of them robbed the other and robbed them in the head. You were doing so well for, like, awesome. reading instructions, too. Oh, that's awesome! No rocket speed, but dude, look at the chonkiness. Oh, that's so much bandit. Oh. How do we still have that one? That one flew away. 
Okay. Anyway, we're good. We, we've got bandit launcher. Yeah, something is broke or not. This guy fucks up, fails to read instructions, gets confused, thinks it's a bug. You know what? Go back to vanilla. <laughs> You thought it was a bug too. To be fair, you played before I added the um, mandatory five second d uh, dialogue boxes as a tutorial. Um, but, but you did still miss that when you hover over a hint, it says press E to dismiss. Do TD rocket launchers with bayonets do more damage on direct hits? Oh, <laughs> you know, that'd be cool. For a second I thought that was a serious question, and then I just realized you were coming up with a clever idea. You're dirty won't touch me. I feel like it's a bug and Mopey's covering it up. <laughs> I wish. I wish that feature made itself by accident. I had to code in special shit to get the hint dismissal system working. Because I assumed that the hints would get annoying. If you were just like littering the ground with them, farming a boss or something. Or, you know, every time you got a kill, you had to see the same hint, even though, you know, you already knew what to expect. I actually thought that would get annoying. Turns out the hint items, the echoes, are so inoffensive, no one ever even uses the hint dismissal feature. And that's a good thing, too. You know, I'm happy about that, that, like, you know, the hints are, again, like, so unannoying. And actually, like, the loot aspect of them is fun. Yeah, you like seeing them fly out, right? That actually, like, the hints are positive, even if you know what they are. You don't need the hint. Uh, you still like seeing them because they kind of feel like a little bit of, like, loot. Albeit insignificant. Whoops. Hints are a hint you didn't get the drop usually. That too. Right, right, right. They're actually, like, you know, uh, information. Oh, jeez. Um, I don't like the fact that we're on fire and that was the last enemy. Okay, there's another one there. We're still on fire. Damn. Wait, now everyone's dead though, so we actually can't do that. Nature. Okay. You got burned by fire. Yeah, that's right. This is all because your accident is so much hotter than my accident. Mine can't take the heat. Each kill should have an additional hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another thing that um, I saw Jolt's thinking was a bug, which I assumed would be self-explanatory, uh, was his first time getting an enemy that gave multiple instances uh, or multiple chances, multiple rolls of their item. You know, he got the item and then the other one didn't roll, so it gave him a hint. So he was looking at the item on the ground and the hint on the ground. And he thought that was a bug. Whereas, you know, um, I made it that way to indicate to the player 
that, hey, this enemy can drop multiple of their drops. Like in the case of, um... Loader 1340, right? Uh, they're a mission enemy that's part of a long mission, so they give bonus loot because it takes a while to farm them. No, yeah, Jolts was like, uh, that's probably a bug. Someone tell Mopey. These are always for your expectations. Yeah, right, right, exactly. It's not Jolts' fault. Um, it's just in my head that made sense, but that's my head. Not everybody's head. People who didn't watch development, I can see that being confusing. Sure, sure. Yeah. Can see that on the That's true. I also did not include that on the tutorial text. No, see, the way that it uh, worked in my head was when you saw hint, that was placeholder for drop, right? Therefore, if you see multiple hints, those are placeholders for multiple drops. Um. But, yeah, no. <laughs> Alright, give me, give me another good world burn. Another one that I can be happy about in some way. You, Fine. We shall Damage. Mag. Soon. Rocket speed. All right, actually, that's an even better world burp. Good. Good. It all worked out in the end. We just farmed a better version. By accident. The, the what now? The Echo Missions, like Tundra Patrol, don't have loot beams. Is that normal? Yeah, I tried my damnedest to fix that. Um to get them in such a way where they did respawn, uh, but also still kept their uh, uh, exclamation points over them. Um, you'll notice the exclamation point does show up on the minimap, right? But it doesn't show up, you know, like when you look at them. And I, I did everything. I tried everything to fix that. Nothing worked. It's a particle effect, and, um, you know, maybe I could, like, pick the brain of, like, some other modder that knows particle effects better, or something, to be like, what, hey, why isn't, you know, this particle effect that I'm trying to force showing up? Unfortunately, I mean, really, it's, like, it's actually not a big deal. Uh, you know, again, look at the mini-map to look for your, uh, available missions. Make your own particle. No, see, it's not a matter of making my own particle, it's just getting a particle to show up, you know? Hey, scared kid, good to see ya. Alright. Back to Tundra. Let's do not farmhouse, because I'm going to forget again. <laughs> and actually, let me... We're running a little long here, but let me finish this mission. Whoops. Can you make it so I can't accept those echo missions too fast? Actually, you know, that might be helpful in general, preventing um, any missions from being able to be picked up too fast, because right now I'm having to redo party prep because I fucked up and I just mashed enter. And I picked up an earlier mission in the chain, cutting me off from the one that I wanted. Um, <laughs> I need to save me from me too. Okay. Good. Good. Uh, this will work better. Please excuse Madame von Bartleski's disposition. She's rich. Nope. I don't like this. Uh, we have orchids. Can I get a stack? Yeah. Got her. Okay. 
You know, I should have left that guy alive. Now I just now. need you to find Princess Fluffy Butt. But my teeth come farm. It's the easiest thing ever. Oh, nice. Oh my god, that is absolutely the calm that I would want the fastest check source on. Oh, Got a seeker. Don't think I ever used it. There you go. Oh, that's the fun right there. Using the seeker. Who does that? Okay, where's my easiest scrap metal? There's like a bunch over here. <laughs> Thing chunks. <laughs> guys, guys, did you hear that? Someone just said in regards to the seeker, this thing chunks. good <sighs> tomorrow tomorrow yeah tomorrow i'm sorry i gotta go tomorrow we um uh continue uh this one life action we have to just farm bane no did i say bane the other thing orc we have to farm the orc then we start uvhm get a foothold there with what information we have so far exciting stuff Kind of nervous, because, you know, really what we're going to be doing is rushing foothold and then starting new, yet further unknown content in One Life in UVHM. All the DLCs, all the missions, it's going to be real different. I'm looking forward to it, but yeah, One Life and stuff. Anyway, hope to see you guys then. Normal time, 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, 18 UTC. Thanks for being here tonight, everybody. Really, thanks for the fun. Um, thanks, Gage, for streaming right now so that we can go hang out with him instead while he plays Loot Rando. God, Gage is the best. Oh, that's so good of Gage, even though we already streamed today, you know? Um, and also, you know, thanks, everybody, for all the support tonight. Thanks, thanks for the donations and the subs and the gifts and the hosts, y'all. Y'all are, like, real nice and generous and stuff, and I appreciate us being able to do this because of y'all. This is so much fun. It's, it's thanks to you. Anyway, till tomorrow, till Gage's stream tonight, have a good night.